get into this. We won't do a cold open. We will begin. We will Perfect. begin the riffs. Perfect. Ooh. Oh, yeah. when you fucking booted up the stream completely. All right. Or are we already? Perfect. Uh, we we are. Perfect. Yeah, we're we're rolling. We're going straight into <laughs> New Vegas. Dub. We're going in, gamers. Yes. So, do you share your screen with me or what? Uh, yeah. I will. Okay. I will see what I can do. Yes. Okay. Cool. We're going. So, this whole thing kind of just—it's it, like I don't know. I guess it's like a podcast, but there's a game underneath it. Mm, the game okay. is the That's game good. is kind of just background noise while we ramble. The game is secondary. Yes. To the, to, to the to good. The bits going on. To the bits. Yes. Yes. Ah. So how's your week been? How's uh, your week been, buddy? It's been, it's been good so far. Yeah. No. I'm I'm trying to. I'm trying to find meaningless sex on Grinder, but I keep making friends. <laughs> it's 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 not it's not good. That's better than meaningless sex. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying. Better than meaningless sex, 100. I feel like you know <laughs> the thing with the trying to explore my homosexuality is like a friend told me that it was like a guy who just bought a gun and he was like waiting for his house to get broken into. <laughs> that's exactly. That's exactly it. That's how I feel right now. <laughs> oh fuck. Please. That's exactly how you should feel. <laughs> Please, I'm it's just. A, it's a fucking gamble. It is, isn't it? Yes. Go, right. You could go to somebody's house and they could ask you to put on a, a fucking um. What is it called? Uh, I had a, I had a dude ask me to put on like a. You, you, you ever seen one of those wrestling, like un, unitards? Uh yeah. Unitards. Yeah. yeah. Wear one of those. And he pulled it out and he was like, "Hey, can you wear this?" And I was like. Uh, <laughs> around, and there was a big, there was a big hole cut out in the back, and I was like, at, at the asshole, and I was like, or no, I, I wasn't even there for a hookup. I was just there to hang out. Yeah. And, and he was like, hey, I, I found this, uh, in my room. It's so crazy. It's kind of funny. And he was it's like, you know, it's like, oh, that's weird. That is kind of goofy. It's weird that you have that. I don't know why you're showing it to me. Because <laughs> it's, like, it's so funny. It'd be really funny if you tried it on. <laughs> I was like. I was like, I guess so, man. That'd be hilarious if my asshole was out. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna leave. <laughs> yeah, bye. Normally, I like getting my asshole out. I've seen the pics. You made it weird. Yeah, you made this weird, dude. <laughs> um, number one uh thing to never have it a hookup is don't have a have like a a mirror on the wall. Oh yeah. That you can see. Oh. Because you'll look at yourself. Okay. When this atomic fire specific. consumed the earth, I'd probably go into too much detail. Did so in but I went to a dude's place. house, and um, this is when I was still doing that type of shit, and yeah. I, I haven't done that out across the I think this is the last one I ever did, actually. Yeah. Uh, and and I, he tribes. went and got like a, he was going to get condoms and shit. Yeah. And there was a mirror on the wall, oh. and I looked at myself in the mirror, and I was like, "What the fuck am I doing here?" Yeah, no, I. I crisis i had that happen to me after my first hookup like we, we we were like together and then he got up and like i was looking and he was like trying to show me funny videos on youtube and i could see him from the back and i was just like looking at his dick and balls and thinking bro how did i get here <laughs> how am i you're trying to show me like fucking meme videos on youtube and we're just like both naked <laughs> And That's cool as fuck, though. I like that that shit. That guy, no, well, he he was like nice, but he was like a spurgy as shit. I don't think he ever left the house. <laughs> oh fuck, no! That sounds like a fucking nightmare, actually. No, I was like trying to relate to him as a person. I was like, "Yo, do you want me to bring you like cigarettes or beer or maybe some weed?" He was like, "No, I just drink water." And it's like, <laughs> what the, what's her uh, yeah, What's her character name gonna be? Um, fucking. It'll be. I, I was we'll, gonna do something stupid, edgy like Epstein, but I feel like that's too. We'll do um, you, actually. Uh, yeah, this is all about you. Yeah. We'll do post. Like Bailey. Bailey. Okay. Bailey or post? Either one. Bailey. <sighs> Perfect. Oh yeah, no, it was like record scratch type shit. I was like, how did I? How what? <laughs> what I was like, I, I was like trying to relate to this person, but they only like animated when they were talking about League of Legends, and I was like, oh, <laughs> you're <laughs> you're that kind of spurg. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm gonna be honest. I've dated I, I the uh, the guy I'm dating right now is into Dota. Yeah. And 
I before that, um, I had a friend who I thought was cute, and they did they did Dota two. Yeah. Um, and my roommate, uh, who I'm not gonna say is a Spurg, but he's like, he's, he's probably the most awkward out of all of us. Uh, in the League of Legends. Oh man, <laughs> Bailey, oh, man, I like, I, I just avoid boys who are into MOBAs now. It's like you gotta hit your head on a rock to like that shit. No, they're cool. I, I don't. Okay, MOBAs aren't cool. Yeah. Most of them are self-hating. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Most of them hate themselves for addiction to Mo for their crippling addiction to Dota's a game series a genre that's just like dog shit completely. Like I have had, I have nine hundred hours in Dota two, and it's like the only time with gaming I actually regret. Yep. Like I could have fucking, I could have learned how to play violin or something in that time. I had that with um Rainbow Six Siege. Really? I like Hail that game. The king, baby. I, no, no, no. I love Rainbow Six Siege. I love it. But if you stop playing, I stopped playing for like two months. Yeah. I came back to it. And I was like pretty, like I played, that was like one of the few multiplayer games I put like 200 hours into. I don't wow. game that much, honestly. Yeah. Um, But I put 200 hours into it <sighs> and I came back and I was a pretty high level. And I was like, even casual games, I was getting put yeah. into like higher level matches and so people were just yelling at me for being dog shit <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck the maps were like <laughs> and like my aim isn't very good my my only strength in that game was map awareness mm. and uh and game awareness and so when i came back to it there was like new shit oh. i was like oh i'm dog shit at this game it's one of those <laughs> games where it just like gradually starts to just keep taking bigger and bigger shits on your hard drive yeah like the game just keeps yeah. getting bigger I have Modern Warfare, and that's 200 Hail gigabytes. The king, baby. <laughs> oh, I have my friends play that. They're just like, oh, another 20 gigs of updates. Yeah, I guess this will be the only game I play for the next year. Oh, man. Yeah, exactly. Like, I bought... Give me zero charisma, you fucking asshole. <laughs> I, I, look, it's not my fault. It's a dump stat, okay? I'm being pragmatic. I should probably just say this straight up. I can't roleplay. I'm a... I'm a What's the term for the person who just wants to make like their character as powerful as possible? Uh, Munchkin or something? I, game? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know the RPG term. I don't know, man. I, I was trying to get into like tabletop for a while, but I'm fucking really bad at it. <laughs> my imagination <laughs> my, uh, is my gone. Oh, uh, fuck. Okay. I could probably get into it. I don't know. There's too many fucking... I got to read too much books and shit to get into the, the, the fucking like role-playing, yeah. that type of shit. Hey, you, too many instructions. You gotta wear the maid dress if you want to come role play with us. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do You'll do it, yeah. Uh, I, I'll fucking put that thing on. Right. Whenever I get high, sometimes I'll just I'm put that shit on. Your friend, yo, is this shit funny? Your roommate <laughs> just like your roommate just comes in and you're like staring at the wall, <laughs> just like, <laughs> bro. And what is a nun for a? Uh, Halloween last year at high school and uh, high school. Mm, oh god! And, uh, I had some dude at a party get me confused for a chick, which was pretty funny. That is pretty. Good. They said I was an ugly chick, though, which is pretty mean. Oh, that's pretty. <laughs> that's fucked up. <laughs> they said my forehead was really big for a chick. <laughs> and I was like, Damn, that's are you pretty mean? <laughs> are you getting? Do you get? Do you ever get like mammed? <laughs> no, I never get mammed. Oh. I don't go by that. I don't go by that IRL, but. Uh, you know, I've never gotten man. That'd be really fucking that, funny, though. That'd be funny. You have, like, the boy motor green text happening to you? <laughs> <laughs> no, I met a fucking boy motor. Like, like uh, I think there's a boy motor at my um, my school's market. Like, we, we have, like, um, a little, like, gas station type shop mm -hmm. under the art, our mark cafeteria. Yeah. And uh, one of the chicks there, I think, is boy moding, and I can't tell. I've had... <laughs> I've had like the the thing with being gay now is that you notice other gay people, yeah, <laughs> and it's like some they live type shit where you're just walking <laughs> down the street and you're stopping at the traffic lights. You turn around and you're like, oh, <laughs> hello. <laughs> at at my age, at like uh, nineteen or like eighteen, uh, or just in high school or or like early college in general, it, gaydar is completely skewed now because of the existence of e boys. Yeah, no, everyone, everyone's, it's, it's like metrosexuality's come back, hasn't it? Yeah, everyone dresses like a massive homo, and there's no, uh, there's no way to guess, to, to gamble. That's good. You have to take a gamble. You have to take a gamble. <laughs> that could be, it could be, everyone could be boy motoring now. There is one boy motor in Brisbane, and according to the boy motor map, yeah. <laughs> oh, shit! Okay, wait. 
I heard about that and I haven't used it. Is it? Do people just like register themselves? They on that? they do, and uh, it shows their exact address. So, <laughs> which I'm like, I had I had a bit of a horror thing on Grinder where like I I was talking to like. Okay, so my next door neighbor is like on Grinder, and we're both boys, and we're just like messing yeah. each other. Yo, this is funny as fuck. We're both gay, and there's like a, a trans girl who lives down the road from me, and I messaged her the same thing, and I forgot that that's fucking terrifying for them. <laughs> it's like, yo, you yeah. live down the street. No, no, no. It's like, yo, you live down the street from me. Yo, what if I walked out and said hello to you, bro? Wouldn't that be funny? No, this is really fucking scary. <laughs> You forget that there's like a different tone you're supposed to use. Yeah, you're not supposed to be like, "Yo, you're gay as hell, faggot." Yo, faggot. Yo, what if I what if I like fucking yelled at you while you were on the street? Yo, faggot. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually on this. Uh, I'm actually on this app for jokes. What about you? What about you? Whoa. <laughs> yeah, no. Ha, ha. You'll never know the horror of having your friend be like, yeah, what if I set up a fake dating profile next to you while you have your actual dating profile up? Bro, look, look we said we said you got AIDS, dude. <laughs> That's great. You got 50 feet away from me. What the fuck? <laughs> I love, God, I love going into the city and just feeling like fucking, I was sitting in the bar and some guy who was also in the bar like messaged me like, yo, you want to get your dick sucked in the bathroom? I was like, nah, bro, I'm too depressed. He's like, yo, I understand. That's cool, bro. <laughs> dick sucked in the bathroom. I'm just like, man, I'm just trying to sit and enjoy a beer, please. What skills yeah, do you have, Bailey? I don't want to Bailey? do that. <laughs> what skills are we going to give you? Explosives? Mm, let's see. Um, explosives pretty... Yeah, what did, we, what did we put our skills into? Do we have shit in, like, strength and stuff? Oh, uh, we got, like... Oh, jeez. I, I don't know. We, we got sneak, because, uh... Yeah. Okay. okay we yeah. got. Put, we got. Put some, put some shit in the sea. survival. Yeah. We're gonna get all the useless skills. This Unarmed. Is the opposite of how I play. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No. I. I always go with guns, lock, pick, and speech because I'm fucking boring. Yeah. That's uh, smart. We, we, yeah. We'll go with uh, guns because guns are actually good. I used um. I used melee for my first run. I used. I went entirely melee and entirely charisma for my first run and fucking ate shit for like most of the Yeah, game. charisma is like a dump stat in this. That's what you gotta understand. Using melee on Cazadors is an actual nightmare and there's no way to do it. You can do it. <laughs> so, oh my god. We'll get Victor yeah, killed. We'll get Victor killed by the Cazadors. Oh, yes. Oh, man. Alright, are we killing good springs or, or no? Uh, well, <laughs> Bailey, what would you do in this situation? You've been healed, you've uh, come back to life, you're leaving. I've told myself. Oh, are we role playing? We're realistically role playing. We are role playing. This is you, Bailey. Okay. Let me think about this. Uh, um, what traits do you have? I am a. What, what was that la that bottom one? Claustrophobia. Claustrophobic. I'm not claustrophobic. We got I small am... frame. That's you. What's hot blooded? Hot blooded For is. Uh, oh, small frame. <laughs> yes, yeah. small frame. That's you. You got that nice the ectomorph build. Yes. Uh. Hot blooded. When your health drops below fifty percent, you gain fifteen percent more damage, but you also mm -hmm. suffer two to your agility and perception attribute. Yo, Bailey's about to go eight mode. I'm about to go chimp mode. I'm about, to, about to return to go into monkey mode. Yeah, and that's what the, that's what the trait was originally called. Should we get wild wasteland? Uh, actually, yeah. Fuck. That's that's yeah, the Reddit wild perk wasteland. where all the cool shit happens. That way, yeah. That way, it's just it's just like in the vault boy, but he's making like the Reddit moment face. <laughs> the Reddit, the Reddit. Uh, he's giving a fucking upvote. Hmm. <laughs> oh god. I really don't like the fucking how the how the character models look in this game, or or like anything up to like Skyrim. Fuck you, this is Jonathan. The thing with these games is like they were really they're really fucking ugly to look at. Yeah, they are fucking horrible. They're just... Even uh, Fallout 4 looks like pretty much dog shit. Everybody looks like they're melting. Everyone looks like a Dreamcast character in that. Yeah, everybody looks like they've had a stroke at some point in their life. Are we doing hardcore mode? Mm, I, have you played hardcore? I have. Um, no, I, I usually don't because no. I don't want to worry about like. Don't play hardcore. Things. Don't play hardcore. That shit's fucking lame. Especially with how much this game crashes. Do not play hardcore. <laughs> That's just not worth it. Oh, no. All right. All right, we're going out. We're going out into the world. We're getting out there. We're getting out with the boys. <laughs> All right. Let's go. First uh, mission is yeah. to uh, 
get TNT from Pete. Yep. And then blow him up with his own Bazinga. TNT. That's how we do it. We're doing, first. <sighs> we're doing it uh, not at all correctly. We're gonna do it how Reddit. Yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna do a Reddit playthrough actually. Reddit playthrough. <laughs> Bailey the we're Redditor. Doing a Redditor playthrough. All right. <laughs> My Bailey Redditor playthrough. The Bailey Reddit. Yes. <laughs> it's his last name. <laughs> yeah, hello, Easy Pete. Easy Pete. Easy Pete. <clears throat> <laughs> uh, yes, this is how Australia looks like. Exactly. This is exactly the same. Oh shit, I forgot there's chat. Fuck. Yeah, no, you can like just read the chat and maybe they have fun. Maybe they're like saying slurs and I don't know. I haven't been reading it. Oh, perfect. How the fuck? Ah, there it is. There it is. There it is. Yeah, Bailey, you can interact with the chat. Because they're, awesome. yeah, they want to see you. Var raging right now. Oh yeah, oh, I forgot. I Did you? Are you? You're familiar. You're probably. Are you like? You're probably too young to know who Burzov is, right? Burzov? Uh, I don't think so. Varg uh, Yeah. Okay. Oh. Well, he's like a black metal musician who is like kind of a meme. Mm hmm. But famously, he killed his bandmate. Like. <gasps> yeah. Oh, fuck. Yeah. He he. It was a oh. huge thing. So he was part of like a a band called Mayhem. And they did a lot of really like amazing black metal in the '90s, but then he fucking like murdered his bandmate, <laughs> like stabbed <laughs> him, stabbed him brutally to death, and like to this day claims that it was like self-defense, even though like the autopsy says he stabbed him like 50 times. That's fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah. Wait, so, is there a documentary about him? Uh, there is a movie now, but it's kind of kind of based on fact, kind of based on fiction. Um. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think the world needed like a, a good fellas for black metal, but you know. Everything all right? No, no, no. <laughs> there was a um there was a documentary on some uh black metal I think it was a black metal artist that my friend showed. I think Sunny uh, Smiles uh, is glitching. Dream. Is that the one where Harmony Kareen is wearing blackface? <laughs> that is that is in a black metal documentary. It's called When the Light Takes Us. Harmony Kareen puts on blackface. Uh I think Sunny is glitching. Hey. Hello, Vanilla Shat. Oh shit. Killer. She's in the. <laughs> was is that what you would do? I mean, if she's breaking, yes, she's have no use to us. Okay, <laughs> she, I'm gonna. She has lost all all purpose. That can't be. True. We're going. Uh, we're we're gonna appeal to the. What do you call them? Okay, hang on. No, no, no. We. Okay. Should... Oh yeah, that's what it is. Okay. 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 We fixed it. Don't worry. Next. Girl, girls love having scripting bugs. Tell you what. Yes. <laughs> women women are constantly having scripting bugs. <laughs> God, women be script breaking. <laughs> I ran that women be shopping bit into the ground at my high school and oh, at God. a certain point. It was uh I mean it wasn't it wasn't to the point where like I, I was the reason why people stopped using it. It was another person made us <laughs> stop using it, but but I used it a lot. <laughs> it was very <laughs> <laughs> women be shopping was was very fucking funny. Women be shopping was a good bit, honestly. Yes. Very solid. Yo, Bailey, be honest. Like, how how much longer do you think like the femboy meme has in it? Like six months? Is it becoming too ironic? I, well, to game, it already kind of has. We've had we had the fucking trap trap thing like like in twenty sixteen. Right? Yeah. I was. And then, yeah. When did that die? I don't know. I, I don't think that was. I don't think that's so much a thing anymore. But like. I saw someone wearing a fucking a Hooters shirt today, and I live in Australia. So oh, the femboy Hooters shirt? Well, no, just Hooters, and it's like, oh, okay. they had, like, green hair, and they were kind of, like, mumpy looking, so I was like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> it looked like a big stack of potatoes. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, they, their boyfriend was, like, just this weird Reddit-looking man. I was like, ah, oh, okay. Uh, it is, um, it is saddening. Uh, but, yeah, no, I, uh, I have no idea. The, somebody at my college put up a, um... There's a sign at the, the front door for my dorm building that is an anime girl pointing a gun, uh, like one of those ones that's like, shut up turf or whatever. But yeah. it's like, it says, um, wear the hecking mask or I'm going to break your kneecaps. And it's in like, it's all in black and white because I don't have color printers. <laughs> Got that 90s <laughs> Mac printer. Yes, it looks like something a teacher put up. And I wanted to whatever RA put it up. I wanted oh to eliminate them <laughs> oh my god we, you gotta put up like I, I love seeing people putting up the boy motor awareness things oh yeah that shit's funny that shit is <laughs> fucking funny, funny. 
One of my friends went around and put that up all over her fucking campus. So fucking <laughs> Wait for the boy motor to read it. Yeah, she printed out like a fucking full book's worth of those pages and just fucking hung them up around like basically every door. It was fucking hilarious. <laughs> It's weird, that, yeah. it's weird that the femboy meme had, like, such sway with normies. Like, normal people know what that is now. It's because of TikTok. It's, is that it's it? absolutely 100% because of TikTok, yes. They would have never figured... I mean, they probably would have figured out about it, but it wouldn't be as big as it was if not for TikTok. Which is... Because, like, TikTok is the most normie shit. Yeah, like, I, I'm too old to, like, know what, like about TikTok that well. But, like, yeah. the, the kids like I, it. I think the guys who were doing e-boy shit evolved into doing the femboy shit. And right. now they just kind of... Is it like a sanitized version of it, though? Yeah, oh, 100%. I oh. Mean, yeah, there's no racism, so yeah. That sucks. It's like, what's the point? There's this is... no racism. <laughs> yeah, it's like, dude, they're taking... Uh, we have to... What is it? The gatekeeping anime thing? Oh, God. We have God. to gatekeep femboys. We've got to gatekeep femboys. We've got to bring the racism back. We have to bring the racism back. I really appreciate the work that uh, Cafe Beef is doing for our community. That, oh, God. what? <laughs> like, I was good. I, I've been, like, mutuals with them before they posted their pre-transition pics and blew up. So, like, watching mm -hmm. watching them transform in real time has been quite, quite uh, it's something. A, it's a thing. Yeah, it's, it's something um, to behold to a certain extent. He didn't used to be that unpleasant. No, I think um, popularity uh, morphed into, like, I don't know. I think there's a lot of self hatred going on there. There's yeah. Deep, deeper, deeper cuts there that I don't, I don't quite. I, <laughs> I don't know how to quite like, you know, fully, fully delve into. Oh man. But there are a lot of people in that community that are like that that are less popular than us. Uh, yeah. Community. Oh, that's kind of sad. Cafe beef. It is kind of sad. It's a depressing uh, reality. I think once people get into the spotlight like that, that aren't like, not, not, not maybe meant like. I'm not mm. saying mentally de developed, but like they're they're not like um in a good state and mm. they gain a lot of popularity. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can fuck you up. <laughs> like, I, I yeah. Something I worry about is that the director of this game follows me on Twitter, and I worry that he is gonna like tune in. Oh, oh fuck! I've seen uh fucking what's his name? Uh, he posts funny shit on his fucking Twitter too. Sawyer, yeah, oh, he, he's a good dude. He's he does not seem bad at all. No, he follows me. He follows you? He's probably no, seen the... I, oh, he, God, he yeah. No way he will. <laughs> he will. I... I... You need to DM... I need, oh. hey, buddy, I need you to DM him and... and be like, yo, to follow, me. follow, please, follow this guy. He's a huge so, fan so, of Fallout New Vegas, as you can tell. I do. I love Fallout New Vegas. I know all the characters. Benny and... Uh, Sam, the guy... Yeah, I know all of them. I know characters. all of them. My I played this game like two years ago, but I do love it. My favorite game, uh, Fallout New Vegas, Dark Souls, and Final Fantasy XIV. Hello. Please put your fist through my head. <laughs> Wait, which one's fourteen? Is that the fucking MMO one? That's the MMO that all the shut-in people like. <laughs> Don't be mean to my friends. I'm not being mean. It's just a thing. No, no I, completely, I, I completely understand. <laughs> You're completely correct. I am. Oh uh, fuck! It's um, it is. I don't understand the appeal. I don't. Uh, I don't play MMOs at all. I don't either. Uh, the closest I've ever gotten was a friend convinced me to play Destiny Two with them, and I played that for like oh, twenty hours. Look at the look at the dog behind Sunny Smiles. That game sucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! <laughs> dog is just chilling there. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. Stop animating. <laughs> Stop your walk cycle. All right. I do. Yeah, I love how Bethesda games, everything just freezes around. Oh, you. it's so funny. You just, there's just a terror in like an NPC running towards you and you knowing you're going to lose control of the camera. <laughs> uh, what's it? What is it? Um, it doesn't he, does the outer worlds do the same thing where everything freezes or does it just, like, I, it, it might. The outer worlds is like so weird. It's like they had complete freedom and they're like, yeah, let's just make a Bethesda game. Yeah, I didn't, um, I didn't like it. <laughs> no, I, I didn't care for it. With how much I didn't like it. I think it came out right around the time Disco Elysium did, and I was, like, really into that instead. Mm -hmm. I saw you and Creel's tweet about that, how, um, it's, like, such a big, like, contrast almost. Oh, it's... With, like, writing wise It's just, yeah, no. Disco Elysium I absolutely adored. Yeah, Disco Elysium is, um, I'm dyslexic, 
and so oh. I couldn't. I literally couldn't play it. Oh. I played like maybe three hours of it, and then I was like, I can't keep going. Is there is there it. like a if you make the text bigger, it gets better kind of thing, or is it just like? I mean, yeah, it's just it just kind of takes a long time. Oh. So I was like, uh, I'm gonna go play something else. I don't know if if I I really appreciate it when games like um I think Wasteland Three has full voice like uh is fully voice acted. Yeah. I'm considering getting that, but also I'm very bad at like RTS games, so uh, I wasn't about to do that. Uh, I'll, not RTS games, I'll do it on stream and I'll invite you and I'll just read the whole thing for you in Thank funny you. voice. Yeah, see, it's like <laughs> this is it. This is how we accommodate our guests. We're just like, all right. Yes. I was this is my, this yeah. Is my disability accommodations. You read everything to me. <laughs> Can you read this? Just getting your boyfriend to like read it to you. That'd be really cute, actually. You do it, man. <laughs> that would be cute. I, I would like that. <laughs> I have asked people to do that for me because I'm fucking stupid. <laughs> I've asked people to fucking play video games. I have. There's a. There's a. Um. I watched uh, a dude play Persona Five and and read all of it because I I couldn't handle it. I, I didn't watch the whole thing, but uh, we played a, a big enough sum of it for me to get the uh, the gist. Nice. Yeah. Persona 5, uh, also, I, I just can't, I don't, um, I can't get into turn-based RPGs, my brain is too ADHD for that, that's what Zoomer brain does to you. Man, Zoomers got it, like, it's something I, I notice when I talk to Zoomers now is that they're like, like, I thought I was retarded growing up. Oh yeah, no, we're it, it's, stupid. Oh. <laughs> we're really dumb. It's, oh, <laughs> it's not, it's not good. Oh, yeah. No, it's not. There's a, there's a very large amount of internet poisoning that I think... I think it's, uh, yeah, it's it's something I do appreciate about Zoomers is that they're very much, like, open about going on the computer. Because I was the only kid in school who, like, went on the computer, if you get what I mean. Yeah, yeah. I was, yeah. No, I had a kid, I, I knew a kid in middle school who had a 4chan flag background, and I wanted to push him over. Yeah, no. <laughs> I was, like, I was, like, yeah, I, I remember exactly where I was where I like when I, like, found out that other people knew about the internet. And I just had this like kind of sick feeling in my gut, like, oh, my treehouse has been invaded. No. <laughs> it was right. It was right when social media was coming. It was right when Portal oh, introduced. Like yeah. yeah. Oh, it was awful. My face. Fucking hell. Awful shit. That I, shit would suck. And with you, it's like I, I don't know. Uh, yeah, we've kind of just always had it. Yeah. Like one of my one of my favorite memories or most of my favorite memories from like Hail to the elementary game, school like upper elementary school and like fucking sixth grade was like watching smosh oh <laughs> that man was it. yeah god <laughs> like watching smosh with friends and stuff and i mean now i'm like yeah that's horrible but but as a child uh smosh and ray william johnson are very funny to you and now they're just they're hilarious for another reason <laughs> Whoa, wait have you seen the ray william johnson the the movie ray william johnson was in Wait, what? No. Was it like a shitty horror movie? I can't quite remember. No, it was a fucking drama movie about a disabled kid. Is he disabled? No, no. He's not disabled. He's an asshole to a disabled kid. I want to be a YouTuber. <laughs> son, you can, can't do that. you can never be a YouTuber, son. I'm going to drink out of the toilet. That's what... Oh, fuck. Hold on, I have to find this. Uh, yeah, yeah, there it is. Wait, he was, the son from Breaking Bad is in that? What the fuck? think so does he actually have cerebral palsy no that kind no of... maybe oh. i don't whoa was he maybe he's just really good at playing a disabled person damn he does really... yeah he does okay he does have cerebral palsy he does indeed oh, shit. Yeah. Right. well i'm not making fun of him so that feels okay. yeah okay it's all right we, we all heard it bailey it's all right <laughs> i love no 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 <laughs> we're canceling you bailey sorry oh, oh fuck there's this very specific clip that was going around Twitter when that movie came out, and it's of, um, I can't find it. All I can find is the trailer, mm. but it's a clip of William Johnson telling the kid, I think, to, like, eat shit and die, and he's <laughs> fucking driving off in his, like, SUV. <laughs> oh, <laughs> God. So it's fucking hilarious. If anybody in chat has the clip, please oh. fucking post it. There's that clip from it's... that movie that, that I, my friends used to always, like, post and joke about where he drives up and he's like, I want to fuck you in the ass. And it's like, why don't you go fuck yourself, asshole? And he goes, I would if I could, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen that one? No, I've never fucking seen that. Oh, one. it's that? it's from like a Ken Russell movie. I think it's from it's from the, it's from his movie Whore. Yeah, just like. Oh, 
That's a good name. I would if I would if I could, <laughs> bitch. I would if I could, bitch. <laughs> you can look up that clip. Yeah, I would if I could, bitch. By the way, have sucked my own dick. Doesn't it's not cool. Really? Not Wait. Wouldn't recommend. That's no. why. That's why you got thin. That's why you did all that exercise. <laughs> so, I can suck my what, dick. so what? Ha wait. What happened? Was it like? Was it cool? And then you remembered that you were sucking a dick? No. No. Opposite. 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 It's oh. not. It's not at all like sucking a dick. It's because you just like. So you have to like scrunch your back up, and then so you're you're like on your head, and you have to scrunch your back up so your penis reaches your mouth, and then. <laughs> Only really like fit the tip in. I was thinking of oh my <laughs> like your, your roommate walks in and you're just like when you're wearing the maid outfit and sucking your own dick. <laughs> my roommate is looking at me right now and saying and mouthing stuff to me so he doesn't say anything on the stream. Oh, what are you gonna say? Just say it. Say it, brother. <laughs> he said you have to stop. You've gotta do it though. No, listen, Bailey's stop. roommate. <laughs> Is it a nice head? Like, I'm not giving a demonstration. No, yeah, no. Okay. Like I, I can't anymore. I could like a year ago. That'll be like the that'll be the tier three sub like gift. Bailey yeah. will send you a picture of him sucking his own dick and taking a selfie somehow. <laughs> I have a picture of me in the position where I suck my where I would suck my own dick, but it was fully clothed. Oh god. Um, you're just you're so you're you're basically you're on your shoulders and you have your legs over you. And you're like you push your legs down into your face, oh. or you're like your waist down into your face. Mm. And it hurts your spine really bad unless you stretch for like a, like I literally fucking practiced for a month. I got a limber. You practiced for a month to suck your own dick. Yes. <laughs> it's just like one man, one vision. One day I'm. What is your goal? You're just personal trainer being like, yo, what's your goal here? And you're just like, yeah, I want to suck my own cock. I am trying to get skinny so I can suck my own dick. <laughs> <laughs> God, they just have like a training montage and it just ends with you sucking your dick. <laughs> That's ex somebody just said, okay, somebody said I'd rather just sit on my arm until it goes numb and then jack off. I don't, I've tried that and I get pins and needles in my hand and then it sucks. I don't I want that. I love that you trained for a month to suck your own dick. I just, I'm just thinking yeah. about, you're just running up the stairs from Rocky and then it's like, it just cuts to you trying to put your dick in your mouth. <laughs> No, no, okay. It was just like, it was just because I wasn't limber enough, right? So like gymnasts and stuff, Yeah. you know, they, they basically, their, their training is A, physical fitness, like mm. getting fit enough to like fling yourself around and shit. Yeah. And B, becoming like limber enough to like lift your legs up over your head and shit. That was basically what I was doing. God. Uh, this is what I spent my Christmas break on, by the way, of, of <laughs> senior year. <laughs> what do you want to do on the school holiday, Bailey? I'm gonna train to suck my own dick. I'm gonna suck my <laughs> own dick. Um, basically, what happened? You don't. It doesn't feel like you're sucking your own dick. You just have your penis in your mouth, and you're like, kind of sitting there, and you're like, okay. I love that. I love oh this stream has taken on such a great tone now that I know that your roommate is just listening to this. <laughs> that, he just left the room after oh, I just started talking about sucking my own oh, dick. Oh, come back. <laughs> come he back. He just got. He's just like, man, I'm gonna go have a smoke. Yeah, he's in the um. He, we're, we live in a suite, so there are two uh two dorm rooms on oh. one side, which makes our, our little our tiny little hallway and a bathroom. I uh, um, I I live like on like a th in like a three floor like apartment, so I live in the like right next to the kitchen. So people are always just coming and going, and like I just worry that they're gonna hear me like talking about shit on the stream. <laughs> I'm pretty sure my neighbors have heard me say shit like fucking retarded shit. Oh man, <laughs> I I bring like people over to the house sometimes. I'm like, no, you have to change in my room. Please do not come through my fucking living room like that. <laughs> I don't care at this point. There was a there was a point when I re where I kind of gave a shit, and now and now that I'm in college and I like hardly know anybody because of fucking quarantine, I just oh, no. don't care. You don't care anymore. Oh man. No. No, I've been going. I've been uh, going to hang out with this uh, one like trans chick that I know um, in the other dorm, and I had to trip sit for her yesterday. Yeah. And and apparently her like some of the people on her floor are kind of dickheads about it. Oh. But I uh, apparently I I they were like I don't know I don't know if they were being jokingly nice to me where they're like being like the dickish kind of nice. Oh. Like, they just like thought I was cool, but 
I have no idea. They said they liked my hair and that I looked like somebody who would like Joy Division, which is true. Because I have a Joy Division. <laughs> that is <shirt>. true. <laughs> oh man. But God. whatever. I was like on a date with like a, a kind of feminine boy and like he was like a very stereotypical like gay like liked Madonna and Lady Gaga and that shit. So we were just like going about stoned. And I was like sto mm -hmm. so stoned I didn't even give a shit that people were staring. It, it, it kind of ruled, yeah. We didn't have anything in common, unfortunately. Yeah, that's yeah I couldn't, I couldn't like joke about 9/11 to them. Blame. <laughs> no, I know. It's like, when do you do that? The fourth date. My boyfriend says me edgy memes all the time. Yeah, it's like, yeah, this is this is just how this is how we do. You gotta hook up with somebody halfway across the country. That's basically, yes. yeah, exactly. And it's like, That's how it works. the best relationship I ever had was like long distance. And we were just sending each other like memes of people eating things and like, and, and me being like, yo, this is going to be me eating your ass, dude. <laughs> 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 me. That, that was, that was the best relationship I ever had. It was, yeah, no, it's not. You know, there's a there's an element of making it's kind of it's a, very difficult because uh, communication and shit is very hard from that yeah, distance. No. Just, but, um, yeah, just yeah. Nice elements are are very nice. I had like, yeah, no. There's like I I would often chat like boys up on Grinder and then like I'd get along so well with them and then I'd find out they live like a state away. Yeah. And it would just be like, yo, bro, I'm gonna make you leak like a faucet, and then it'd be like, <laughs> and then it'd be like, oh no, you live a state away. Oh. Okay, um, I don't know if they're watching the stream right now, but, um, so I have, I have, like, a childhood friend that I've known since I was maybe, like, two. Yeah. Uh, and we kind of, I, he left my state, <laughs> sup, Jonathan, <laughs> and he left my state, <laughs> um, when he was, like, I think, 10 or yeah. 11, um, and, and then I got, like, sent, night, like, not big on Twitter, but oh. semi-big on Twitter, to nice. the point where, like, not not uh, Cafe Beef Ava, but a mm -hmm. different Ava. Yeah. Uh, saw uh, the the you know the 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 kind of like uh, jacked, cute trans chick that's on Twitter. I think I do. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know, but we're we're mutuals, and she's she runs a podcast. Uh huh. And apparently, he listened to that podcast. Oh. And followed her on Twitter, and <laughs> she I think he retweeted the made picture of me, and then. He took a he took a screenshot of my Twitter account and then sent me a message on like over over the phone <laughs> and was like, "Hey, is this you?" <laughs> and I was like, "I fucking knew this was gonna happen. <laughs> I fucking knew it." You weren't supposed to see those pictures. <laughs> you weren't supposed to see. <laughs> Please don't tell anyone. <laughs> You're just like, yeah, bro, I do this. <laughs> this isn't how it's supposed to go. Uh, Bailey, you're supposed to be like, I'll, I'll do anything. Please just don't show it. No, <laughs> no, I was not. I'm not like that. Yeah, I, you I, were, dude. Yeah. You were, admit it. I'm not. I was not like that. <laughs> you were like, oh. I told him, you better not or else I'm going to fucking tell everybody that you're a fucking homo. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a good response, yeah. <laughs> it's the 2020s. He can't, like, just punch you in the head anymore. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> How tell be. everybody that you're a gay homo. And nobody can fucking shit on me for my account because they already follow it. If they follow my account, they're gay. I was, so, yeah, exactly. If you follow me, you're gay. That's that's the biggest yeah. like own that you can do. <laughs> that's the biggest. Oh, you you got me, dude. I can't believe you somehow found my pictures while surfing the web for a oh, very specific uh, niche fetish. That's crazy. Uh, are we gonna help Joe Cobb destroy Good Springs? All right. Yes. 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 Yeah, absolutely. Uh, the thing, yeah. I don't, I don't think it ever. I don't. I actually don't think it comes up in the story ever again. I don't think you do. No. That's right. Yeah. It might just be because I destroyed it like every run. <laughs> I do. I I wanted to like tell people as like a fun party story that I was like made gay, but I don't think anyone would believe me. So no, I want you to tell it. <laughs> like I. I hear the story. <laughs> oh, well, basically, I I think what happened was. I was in like a relationship with a femboy who's now like an MTF and I was like, I, I was still straight and I was thinking, you know, this person's not going to be like my dirty little secret. I'm going to date him properly. I'm not going to be ashamed. And I, I was on LSD. So all of my emotions were like heightened and I was feeling a very intense love for them. And I think that basically like blew a hole in my brain and made me gay by accident. 
<laughs> I couldn't. Co- I think that was it. That might have been it. <laughs> I after you telling me that, I actually really wanted to. I've had I've had two friends tell me that uh, LSD or mushrooms has given them like just a big fucking like self awakening where they've been like, oh I'm wow shit I've been thinking about this all wrong I had to go at this from a different angle or like figured figured something out about themselves which I think mm. is really interesting. That does happen. It's like there's other stories about people like watching sissy porn and like act- accidentally becoming sissies, which I think is very funny. Is it accidental? You 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 watched it. It has to be. Well, there there like there's a subreddit for people who are addicted to that stuff, and and they're like, please, I I don't want to be a sissy. I think it's just porn addiction and and like kind of um uh self hatred. Is porn I think addiction it's a is porn of addiction a thing? I don't know. I'm not talking about me, Jonathan. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, no. Absolutely 100%. How is it among um, Zoomers? Because you would have been exposed to it a lot earlier than I was. I I did not ever really have a porn addiction because I just don't have an addictive personality. Yeah. But my roommate uh, tells me that he had a porn addiction at one point. Get him um, on the mic. Tell us. Tell his story. Yeah. Yeah. I, do you want to tell your story? Yeah. About yeah. Mm, baby. Whack, yo. I want to hear your <laughs> truth. <laughs> Sorry. Did you hear him say shit's whack, yo? I, see, I heard him say shit's whack, yo. That's right. That's all he has to say. That's Yep. That's how it be sometimes, <laughs> now, brother. Now that he isn't d- watching porn, he has gotten a girlfriend in college, like, maybe a month in, and yeah. she's super hot. And also, he's been getting, like, jacked and doing a bunch of protein and talking about maybe getting on steroids. That's the good uh, shit, man. So, yeah, that's how it be. <laughs> I... So much shit has happened since I took LSD, and it all comes back to me walking out of Christopher Nolan's Tenet. That is <laughs> that is the exact point that my life went to like weird, and I think it. I, I think there was like some MK Ultra shit hidden in the sound mixing. There had to have been. So there were, there were flashes. Yeah, no, I, I want to talk about Tenet because I what happened was. I had like the the joy of like going to see a movie isn't seeing a movie; it's sneaking alcohol into the movie. And that's one of the things I start doing now. Obviously, you're, I think you're 18, so you can't drink yet, right? Oh, I'm 19. Yeah. Oh, but yeah. No, I cannot drink yet. That's fucking funny as shit. I love that law. But no, I, I like, I, there's a bottle shop, like, right next to the theater, so they almost encourage you. And I just, like, bought a little bottle of bourbon, and I just spent the movie pouring it into my Pepsi. <laughs> and I drank the whole thing, and I realized, holy fuck, there is still, like, 90 minutes of this movie left. And I was like, I'm going to do it. I'm going to get up and I'm going to walk out of a movie. I stole that woman's toaster. And I did it. I actually fucking did it. I, I got up. I, I walked out. I went home and I streamed the movie Walker, which is one of my favorite films. And then yeah. my life took on a very, very strange. Uh, ten. It took on a very strange. Uh, uh, I don't know. Something very weird. Weird things started to happen. So one of the things that happened was my relationship that i was in with the uh male to female uh woman kind of it, it it fell apart in a lot of ways she was just she had a very bad home life and she couldn't like focus on me she had to focus on like her transition and stuff and her bad home yeah. life had to be sorted out and all that shit so she couldn't have a relationship with me and that kind of that kind of broke my heart real bad because i was like opening myself up and we couldn't be and i couldn't do anything because uh, obviously quarantine prevented me from getting her out of that situation but like, yeah. uh, what happened was I thought, okay, I'm gonna process this breakup by taking more LSD. Oh, okay. And I'm like, okay, I'm doing good on this trip, and I get a I get a quote tweet saying, "Stop fucking tweeting while you're on LSD. This shit sucks." And now my my ego is completely open at this point, so I believe everything someone tells me, and it just kills the trip dead. And I'm just sitting there Hail thinking, the king, baby. oh, God, do I really just annoy everyone around me? Oh, no. And, like, my, my brain just starts spiraling into depression. This is LSD depression. This is very bad. You do not want this to happen while you're alone. And, yeah. uh, and uh, I was like, okay, I know how you're supposed to come off of trips. You're supposed to smoke marijuana. So the thing with that is, uh, I'm sure you know this, Bailey, but you never mix uppers and downers. Yeah, yeah. And basically what happened was uh, as soon as I, like a minute after I smoked that weed, I was just like, oh, God, I feel psychosis coming on. 
<laughs> it was just like I literally left reality. And I was and I was like, you know what? I've been sitting in the backyard like for ten like for what feels like two years. In reality it had been ten minutes. Time distortion had gotten so bad. And I was like, yo, I'll just call an ambulance and go lay down at the hospital for a little while. So that's what I did. And like I could feel myself coming back into my body as the trip ended. Yeah. And it was like weird as shit. And then like I just walked home. They were just like, okay, you, you know how to use a knife and fork again. You can just you can just walk home. Yeah. And I was like, all right, whatever. And then that was that was the end of that trip. And it's like if I had lived in America, that probably would have ruined my life. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's so funny that like you can just go to the hospital here. It is um a shock when you have to think like, shit. If I get like hit by a car, I'm gonna spend like a fortune to get it fixed if I don't have insurance. Mm. Like it's really fucking weird for me to think about that. No, they did not give me a Zan. They just put me in bed. <laughs> you weren't you weren't tripping off a Zan. No, they they were just like, yo, fucking lay down for a while. Damn, that's kind of fucking lame, yo. It was lame. I was like, yo, I want drugs now. Lace me up. Come on, get me fucked up. Get me fucked I up, brother. I want to be fucked up. I want to be Yeah, no, the good... <laughs> the only thing, good thing about going to the doctor's office and getting, like, surgery or anything like that is you get... You get fucked up. That's like, the good shit, man. <laughs> they give you, like, whatever the kid version of morphine was once when I broke my, like, elbow. That was some yeah. good shit. Oh, dude, getting put under is, like, one of the most euphoric fucking feelings in oh, the world, I think. It's so good. It's like you just see, you just feel yourself like fading out. It's nice. It's the best I, uh, thing. If if I could go to sleep on whatever the fuck those sleep like those fucking sleeping that sleeping gas is like every night, I would absolutely <laughs> do it. I uh, mean, it would probably kill my brain. But it'd probably kill you, yeah. But that's like whatever. You get a good night's sleep. Whatever. There's I'll like take, uh, fucking elephant tranquilizer. God, there's occasions where I just like I feel a wave of nihilism come on me, and I just go on grinder, and I'm like, "Yo, what? A Yo, I got melatonin. You want to get nine hours sleep?" <laughs> it's just like you're giving gay people melatonin. <laughs> yeah, bro. It's like, yeah, okay, bro. I got. I can hook you up. Nine hours of pure, uninterrupted sleep. Nice. I have like a That's bottle a of that that I got for Christmas from America. A bottle of melatonin. Yeah. No, you can only get like the. Uh, the fucking the, the, what's the homeopathic version of it here? <laughs> <I'm> a... <laughs> <laughs> you got the homo, bro. You get bro. Your bottle says homo. Oh, Australia's gay as fuck. <laughs> bro, that's gay as hell. All right, sorry. Gay as hell. Do y'all have um? Do y'all have fucking I like? Okay, so uh, I know um Rosie, and she is from Australia. Yeah. And her, or no, she's from New Zealand. Oh, right. She's from New Zealand, which I didn't know was different. Rosie's the kind. <laughs> is Rosie the kind of? Rosie's kind of tomboyish, right? Am I, am I thinking? Yeah. Right? yeah, yeah, punkish kind of girl. Yeah, I've seen her. Yeah, she has shown she's up on my feed. Fun. Yeah, her husband is really good at fucking cooking. <sighs> nice. She they make like biscuits and and like with gravy and shit. Mwah, perfect. It was delicious. Um, Bailey, oh, yeah. Bailey, one of the funniest things about you is when you get posted on LGBT. I get posted way too often. I don't engage with 4chan. I don't oh, understand why God. I get posted. There was, People posted me to be. There was <laughs> one of those pictures where I think it was like a deliberately crappy looking selfie where you had like your head in your hand and it was like, do I have oh. potential? Am I going to make it? <laughs> it was that was like, exactly it. Yes. I Somebody posted a picture of me looking like fucking uh, Yandere Dev. Oh my god. <laughs> I have potential in my ass, and I'm like, no, you son of a bitch. Please stop. Uh, there was a thread on B that was, um, the, the header for the thread was the picture of me in like the, the skirt, like the black kind of like uh, emo skirt. And it was, um, uh, boys in skirts thread or some oh, shit like yeah, that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it started normal, and then people just started shitting on boys and skirts, so I left. You had to leave. It got it got too problematic. What was that? Who was in that I, meeting of the meeting of the femboy minds picture? I think it was you, Rosie, and that yeah. one that one girl who made the video of her fucking the pumpkin, which I think I saw. Yeah. Um. She or he is not a girl anymore. He is a guy. Oh. Uh, okay. He's very nice. 
Yeah. He is very nice. His Twitter handle is uh, Ashley Lovecraft. I yeah, I, I think I've seen a video of them when I was like um, very drunk. Him and then let me remember my other friend's Twitter handle because he's not as big. Who the heck is he? Willow? Uh, no, not Willow. Willow, Willow is in New York. Oh. Uh, no, Willow. Um, I have not hung out with Willow. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Yeah. Um, uh, it's Rexy. I think is uh their Twitter handle. Yeah. Um. Let me see. Yeah, yeah, it's just Rexy, Rexy Regicide or something. But yeah, they're they're yeah. all very cool. Yeah. Oh, nice. Um. Yeah. And <laughs> Rosie is a really cool fucking. Their their roommate has a pit bull. Yeah. It's one of the cutest dogs I've ever met. It's like so fucking cute. Did I blow um, that quest? I can't tell if I, I ruined that quest. I think I do. I killed Ringo. Oh, you killed the fucking uh. The wait. So we're doing the. We're doing I, I don't know. I I think I might have I might have blown the quest. Ah, who cares? Just kill everybody in Good Spring. Oh, uh, whatever. <laughs> fuck it. Yeah. Fuck. Fuck that shit. Let's just kill it. Let's just murder <laughs> everyone. We'll kill Joe Cobb too, cause we're chaotic. Fuck it. Yeah. Fuck it. We don't. Yeah. This is like I said. This is the Reddit playthrough. Yeah. Oh, fuck it. Let's just murder. Right yeah. All right. Whatever. Let's do this. <laughs> all right. Again. Oh wait, you quick save? Oh yeah, no, I, I gotta save at the start of the uh the thing. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Did it not give me Gunrunner's Arsenal? Shit. That would suck. Die, Sonny Smiles. Son of a bitch, you dirty bitch. You, you... strip faking. Oh you know the people who like have to have sex mods for these games to get immersed? They're like, look, what? I just, yeah, no, there's like a whole community of people who make like sex mods for these games. Well, I know that, but I didn't know it was to be immersed. I yeah, they're like, I, I can't, I can't play a game unless I can have sex. That's weird. That is weird. Yeah, no, it's like, I, I can't, I can't believe that, that I'm in, I'm in a, a game. Unless I, I can don't want to watch Skyrim sex. That does not sound appealing to me in any way. Well, some people do though. That's the thing. It's like, I know it's, it's kind of weird. I mean, good for them. Good for them, you know what I mean? I, yeah. Am I using Jay Sawyer? But, um, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> Am I using the mod? I don't know. Let's let's just abandon Good Springs for now and go for a walk down the road. I don't think I have the weapons to kill everyone yet. I'll come back and murder everyone, though. Don't worry. Yeah. That's how we You fucking slump on back. That's what All I right. like. What I like is that you can just walk away from the tutorial. You don't have to be a baby like in Fallout 3. I hate it when games make you be a baby. Yeah, Fallout 3 is for bitches. That's right. Fallout 3 fuck so The intro to that game fucking blows. I hate that fucking intro. Oh, it ain't good. Too long. Yeah, you gotta play it like every time too. Yeah, I played it on fucking... Uh, this was before... I played Fallout 3 before I got a PC, so I had to play it without... Um, Somebody said Fallout 3 specification mod in the chat, and I yep. want you to know that I hate you. Um... Yeah, there's a. Uh, are we doing the Indiana Jones? Yeah. Oh, there it is. Good old, bit. good old little bit there. Let's go. Uh, hang on, I gotta go see the uh, the Zyborn clock joke. You do not know what Zyborn clock is, do you? Absolutely. That is that man. is an old fucking man internet joke right there. <laughs> is it like is it like Goatsy old? Very yes, it is actually Goatsy old. Okay. It's like it's like an old something awful project that just never worked out. Got it. And the, Damn, the only shit I know about something awful is is the fucking like stupid shit, like the shit that went wrong. Oh god. Do you know who is? Who? Schmorky. Of course I know who Schmorky is. Okay, cool. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I've I've heard about all that shit. No, I was. Yeah, that shit's so funny to me. <laughs> that shit, fucking. That's that's the good shit right there. <laughs> the horrific shit. Just oh, everyone knew he was like a diaper weirdo for years. Yeah, I didn't know that th that they did porn for a while though. That was pretty oh the me. porn draw. Oh no, the the Dave Bunny stuff they, is like they were in porn. Oh, they were in porn. I'm pretty sure. Wait, they were I, in. I, I did not know that they were in porn. Oh wow. I, maybe they just maybe I think they did like nude photos or something and yeah. then post them publicly. I don't. I don't know. I, don't know. I have no idea. We're queering well, I... bodies. Hmm. <laughs> mm. Even the Marge Damn. Simpson voice. Homie! 
I, I need you to have sex with me, homie. Homie, you're <laughs> queering bodies. I can't, I can't do Marge. Marge is, uh, Marge hurts my throat. Yeah, no. Uh, Homer, I also can't do. Homer's a lot harder. Marge. Marge. I don't want to, I don't want to have sex with you right now. Marge. I don't know. I can't see it. I can't do it. Marge, that's my only fans money. <laughs> Homer. This is my pussy. <laughs> Homer, that's Bart's college fund. Yeah, here we have here we have the balls on the edge of the cliff. Ah, okay. So I've seen this. I didn't know okay. what that was. Though. You're gonna meet. Yeah. So there's a character down here called Johnny Five Aces, I think. Mm -hmm, and so he's he like, yeah, I need whatever the fuck back or something. Yeah. yeah. Oh, actually, no. Is Johnny's corpse around here? It might not be. Oh, a ball fell off the edge of the cliff. I don't know if they put Johnny's corpse there. Do Borat there now. Go. Oh, look at it go. Oh, do Borat. My, my wife. I'm gay. <laughs> it's, like, it's like the come town thing where Stav will always just introduce his characters by being like, I'm gay. <laughs> I'm gay. I'm gay. Oh, I, um... I fucked up, uh, so I, I was really into come to I'm still really into come to mm. I was just fucking hilarious. Yeah, but, dude. uh, in, uh, in high school, I got really into it, and, uh, what was the song? Um, I Likey Gay Sex. Uh, <laughs> I Likey Gay Sex. So I went to a party, yeah. and I'm fucking horrible. I was really bad about taking hints, and I still kind of am. Yeah. Um, except now it's more voluntary. Yeah. Uh, so, oh, I'm, I'm just murdering I, Trudy. Yeah, you go ahead. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm trying to kill Easy Pete. Party, and um, this chick, uh, who's she was kind of cute. Yeah. Uh, like following me around and trying to talk to me. Yeah. And I was like one of the three guys there. Oh, uh, and, the um, game, baby. She kept trying to talk to me, and I was getting drunk and drinking. Uh, uh, what was it? What's it called? Um, what's that? Beer. Malibu. Malibu. Oh. No, fuck. fuck beer. So Malibu good. slaps. Malibu ta yeah. Malibu tastes so good. Yeah. Uh, Mal no, he's not slamming Malibu. Um, no, I'm not slamming Malibu. Malibu. Uh, I was ch I was chugging that shit, and I was going, and 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 she was like asking me questions. So I was like, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I don't know. I just kind of wanted to hang out with my friends at the time. I didn't really want to get my rocks off. Yeah. Uh, and so, <laughs> eventually, uh, I started singing "I Likey Gay Sex." Oh so God. Absolutely. Like not not even loud, not loud, just like humming, like kind of like saying it under my breath. And she heard me, and she just walk and walked away, and then oh, she went yeah. mad sex. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Which hey, if anything, I'm 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 a good wingman. Exactly. That's, that's all that. That's literally all that matters. Dirt. Someone was like, I, I had a a friend from Twitter like come and meet me at a bar, and then we were just talking about like, the Come Town live show. And like they were just telling me that one of their friends was like trying to hook up with the Come Town boys, and she ended up fucking Stav. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh my god. That rules. <laughs> I want to. F I I I don't want to fuck Stav for the purpose of like fucking Stav, obviously. You just want to fuck a celeb. You're a celeb fucker. I want no, I I only want to fuck come the members of Come Town. Oh yeah. Yeah. I yeah. kind of want to fuck Adam. Adam's Adam, Why, Adam, Adam like, and, but Nick is bad. yeah, Adam was like, the, Adam's a man of the people. He came out and like fucking smoked a smoked a cigarette with us. I think the first question yeah. I asked him was uh, if Dasha was there. <laughs> that was while they no. were that was while they were still together. So it's okay. He one of the consequences of me posting that video of um, fucking uh, Dasha crab walking is that he unfollowed me. Oh no, that sucks. Oh damn! It do, it's like funny because I was like, I posted it on my private, and I was like, "Yo, I can't believe Adam unfollowed me." And Dasha responded, being like, "Yeah, worth it." <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, <laughs> I love her. So fucking funny. <laughs> God. My aim is to, is to look like Dasha so that then I can get uh, Adam to Adam to have absent mindedly uh, have sex with me after. God, a I I got some weird fucking quote tweets on that video. People who thought like Dasha was a femboy. <laughs> people on 4chan have fucking posted um pictures of dasha and ask asked if she passed <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty good and people have ironically been like no look at her chin and they've done like the phrenology shit where they like draw over the picture and are like fucking, oh. look at that masculine clear, chin look clear, at all that. clearly this woman has uh, a decent amount of mongol dna in her 
<laughs> no, the Dasha skull is... shape. <laughs> Dasha is ridiculously hot. Dasha's, Dasha, Dasha, is ridiculously yeah, Dasha is amazing. It's like people uh, do that thing with like the red scare girls. who are like, oh, they're so ugly. No, they're hot. No, no, no. They're, no, they are not. They are a they are a weird type of hot. They are. They're they're cool. Um, I don't listen to Red Scare. I I only uh, listen to the ones where they're shitting on other women. That's fair. Because that's that's, that's the <laughs> that's the the one the one aspect of my bitchy gay personality that I could tell was always there. Yeah. Hatred of women. <laughs> Bitter <laughs> hatred. <laughs> Uh, since I've moved in with my roommate, we have uh, slowly radicalized ourselves into more and more uh, anti-women positions, That's, more, more yeah. sexist positions. That's how you gotta do it. I used to be pro women. Now, now I, I'm not fond of them. <laughs> Frankly, I'm just, I just don't care. Frankly, I don't care. It's right, yeah. But, um... That's that, oh, yeah, that's that old school style of gay misogyny where you just hate women so much you don't want to be around them. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, if a woman's cool, I hang out with them. It's just the, you know, I don't want to say the general population of women is annoying, but. They, know, they be like that. Like it's, it's okay, Bailey, you, you can name the woman. Name the woman, <laughs> Bailey. <laughs> name them by name. Give us an address. <laughs> uh, at college specifically, women are. There's something else. So are the guys, though. So it's oh, not, I I was tweeting about this earlier about like how what the fuck is this? You're too. What, I don't even. I don't even remember modding this crap in. You're too. Is, what the fuck? What mod is this? I don't know. This is a fresh install. I think I have crap left over. Yeah, it's fucking awesome. I didn't even know that was a thing. It's not. It's not in the main game. Wait. I know. What on earth? <laughs> hmm. Oh yes. That's pretty dope. Mm. Oh wait, wait. Do you have the fucking text to speech thing set up? I do. If you donate fifty bits, yeah. I I don't even know. I I don't even know what bits are. Oh. <laughs> I've, I've never watched the Twitch stream. I don't understand the concept. You're a zoomer before. and you've never watched a Twitch stream, Jesus. I oh, fucking dude. I watch I I watch the vods on YouTube or I watch the edited. We do have a YouTube, YouTube. channel. By the way, if you're new here because you're here for Bailey, you got to hit all the buttons. By the way, hit the follow button. Yeah, you, you got it. Yeah, Bailey. Up. No, Bailey, you got to say you got to say subscribe to Kimono. For hey, um, guys, you have to subscribe. You have to follow. You have to go to um, my friend here's private Twitter account and you have to hey, DM him pictures king, of baby. your full body. Yeah, completely nude and make sure you're flaccid. <laughs> um, send, him, send, him, send him a flaccid pic and, and then a hard pic. Yep. And if you're a woman, uh, you don't have to send anything. If I right? see, if you send me a picture of you doing that thing where you pull, you'll pull, you'll pull your penis into your pelvic bone to make it look bigger, I can tell. Oh uh, yeah, no, don't lie, don't lie about your. Don't do that. Do not do, do, not do that. I want multiple angles. Actually, send yeah. multiple angles. Main we want to know if you're a girl or show. We're doing a survey. Oh, dude, let's do a survey. Whoa. Let's do a survey. Are you a grower or are you a show? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Ba Bailey, you you go first, man. Uh, personally, no. I'm a grower. Yeah. Uh, I am. Fuck you, man. You fucking only. I. Okay, my roommate is my dick, but and he's lying. Yo, uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Bailey just walks around with his dick. <laughs> I do not listen. All right. Yo, yo Bailey's Bailey's listen. roommate. Get on the mic. Tell us the truth. The people. We got 108 people who want to know the truth. Bailey, big dick or no? I don't know what you're gonna say. You've never seen me hard. The truth about Jake's dick is that I've seen it way more times. Yeah. I, it's honestly surprising. Yeah. <laughs> How's the girth? You've, no, you've seen my ass. How's the girth? Oh, yeah, yeah. Talk about the girth. The girth. What they ask. It's notable. notable. Yeah, especially. Are you calling my dick a showed you fucking asshole? <laughs> I'm fucking get off the mic. Get um, I don't know how it like it kind of like like perches up, you know? Yeah. Are you um, Does it bend in any particular direction? Uh, <laughs> it curves up. It's also two tone. Like oh really shit! Like you. It's no, two -tone. <laughs> that's crazy. All right, we're learning so much about our guest. My good, this is probably the gayest stream I think we've ever done, and not just in the pejorative sense. <laughs> My circumcision is fucking fine, you asshole. What the fuck are you talking Yo, about? Yo, cut, bros.
Sound I'm off cut. in the chat. Wait, are you uncut? No, uh, you're not uncut. That are cut. Sound yeah, off yeah. If I you're cut, cut, you're valid. Are you cut? Yeah, I'm cut. You're cut. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, yeah. We're we're cool. both we're both freaks. It's cool. <laughs> Pound it. Cut, you Pound it, bro. Pound it, bro. <laughs> Let's touch dicks. Let's touch tips. Hell yes. Hell yes, homie. Let's fucking touch dicks. <laughs> hey, all right. Nice work, bro. <laughs> I'll just Yo, like, nice circ, bro. You want me to give you a broad job? Yeah, hey. nice circ, bitch. <laughs> All these, just a bus full of Europeans pull up and laugh at you. <laughs> Please don't laugh at me. All of my homies that are uncircumcised uh, hate it, so I don't... <laughs> How's that? I, I got like a case where I was like with a boy and I didn't know what to do with foreskin because I'd never seen it before. <laughs> it's like, yo, how do you do... What do you do with this? <laughs> Somebody just said they love the cafe beef circumcision art. <laughs> wait, 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 what happened with that? Tell me. They got an they, adult uh, circumcision? Yeah, they got an adult circumcision because they were uncircumcised. What and the f they posted for like, I think a couple of days about how bad their dick hurt. Doesn't that, yeah, that fucking hurts like hell if you do it as an adult, from what I understand. Yeah, yeah, and, th and now they're posting about how they regret having a circumcision. I miss my foreskin. <laughs> I miss, <laughs> give me my foreskin back! <laughs> It just made her more anti-Semitic. It did. She hates. She, uh, you know, uh, they are. Damn, they. It's it's shocking to find out how true the stereotype is to some extent. Of how racist <laughs> fanboys. Are. Oh God, no, they're like they're online. They're online. They're always online. <laughs> it is funny. Yes. It is. It is. Um. It's funny. <laughs> Sorry, my roommate just wrote a tweet. <laughs> it's a my, uh, yeah. Uh, fucking yes, they are. They are cons consistently online, which, as you know, melds your brain. It does. <laughs> it do it do it do be like that. That's that's all it is. That's, um, that's just how it be. That's just how it be. If you were if you were uncircumcised, would you get circumcised now? Uh, no, I, I probably like. No, I, I would keep my... I, I All I do is read about, like, the loss of sensitivity, and it kind of makes me sad. Like, what am I... What, apparently... I well, I don't know. It does. It's like, it's like, what am I missing out on? What kind of life would I have led if I... It's like, what kind of... It's like a sad montage of what my life could have been like if I was uncut. I have enough, <laughs> like, look-wise to care about to not care about my dick cheese. Oh, I, I don't... I have... No, I have a very large penis, and it keeps me happy. So, you know... <laughs> <laughs> uh not having shaving your pubes keeps you from having having any uh dick cheese buildup which is very nice i don't think i've ever had that problem that's mostly because we uh, it's because we don't have foreskins yeah it's because we don't have foreskins yo bro it's, it's uh, literally all it is i don't know what you're talking about man whoa there's a fly here what what in, oh big fly big old fly Float fly. Bathe, yeah, no, all you gotta do is bathe regularly, and it's like, yeah. yeah you're clean. It's just be clean. Well, I, don't have a, I don't have a bath, but I do use my shower, and yes, that works fine. People who complain about dick cheese have, like, serious health issues. Don't spray my hand, you fucking... Mm, I was about to say a bad word. Oh, oh, you can say it. You can say it. We got the pass. It's all right. If, twi all right. if, if Twitch... Don't that word, you fuckwad. <laughs> Sorry, my room... Wait, and for my friend who lives in another dorm is saying that I was not gonna say the N word, you fuckwad. <laughs> oh, don't say that word. We might have to intervene if you say that. Am <laughs> I wrong for assuming that? Hey, no, it wasn't the N word. Bailey. I'm Bailey, it was the N word. Let's okay. We're on a gaming it? stream. The femboy get the femboy gamer is being racist on my stream. They're gonna write Forbes articles about you. They're gonna. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get like that Fantano, the guy who wrote the Fantano article. Like I'm radical. I'm starting a fourth Reich right here. You gotta understand. <laughs> Wait, did somebody write an article about how Fantano was radicalizing people? Oh, didn't you know that? That was like, yeah, that was a thing. What about fucking what, dude? Fantano dude, doesn't post anything. Like, he, he's like, like he's no, he most, like one of the most lib people I've ever seen post, bro. I don't know what the fuck. No, he he, he used to be like an edgy memer back like before oh, yeah. before the alt right people ran that car into that poor woman and it was like a thing that you could explore. Yeah, yeah. And like people were interested yeah. in it, but now it's like now he just good, yeah. the thing with Fantano is that he used to like name search on Tumblr and get into like fights with teens. 
That's really funny. That is really <laughs> fucking funny that he used to do that. That article mind broke Fantano. <laughs> it did. It did. That's He's never so been fuck. the same since. Hey, he was on Sam. He he had Sam Hyde on his stream. He, I don't know. Oh man! Now, I, since you're young, I'm gonna assume you had like a, a phase where Sam Hyde was like a father figure to you. No, fuck no. Oh, every no. young boy I talk to is like that. They're like, yo. No, I I knew Fantano wasn't the same person. Forever. Yeah, no. Uh, but like, I mean, did yeah. you have like an MDE phase though? Uh, I watched um World Peace. Uh, when that was a thing, and I, sometimes I'll watch like the videos where he like talks in his fucking car like a crack addict. Oh, the advice okay, like, videos like, that are like they're shit. blowing up. Yeah, it's like, why would you I take think, yeah, advice from him? I don't know. His life is in the shitter. He, I don't understand he, like, why you would ever take advice from that. He man. lived with like his mom until he was like thirty-two or something. Yeah, and now you're like, I don't know where the fuck. I, I assume he lives in his car. <laughs> I, that's what I can assume. He just drives around vintage cars. Hey, whatever. I guess if you can figure that out, I don't know. But I still think I do think legitimately that that, that Sam Hyde is a comedic genius. He, I think that he, if whoa, that guy is like in the ground. Oh shit! Yo, yo, my my man <laughs> in the ground. He escaped through the ground, bro. He bro, dug a hole. Bro, get out of the ground. Get the heck out of there. Well, no, none of those hit. No, I there got his go. ass. Okay. Don't worry. Yeah, no. Um, Sam Hyde. Uh, I I know that he is a pretty much. Shit, yeah, I think he's just like a horrible person. Oh but, yeah, yeah. Very funny. It's though. fucking hilarious. I mean, the dude, the cop video was fuck. It's so fucking. That was funny. great. I think that's offline now. I can't remember. No, you can find it. Oh I good. Mean, I mean, you can find like a sec second YouTube channel or something. Nice. Yeah. Oh no, they they're always re-uploading stuff. Uh, the cop video, um, the mom's video is really yeah, funny. Yeah, that's the good shit. That shit is fucking hilarious. Uh, but yeah, no, don't, I, I would never take any th anything that he says with any sense of like, you know, I, I should take this man's Oh, advice. God. I mean, his life, he fucking lost his adult swim show and everything, just, and he just fucking lost his mind and started doing roids and shit. Oh, man, the, the picture of him where he has like that orc physique is so fucking funny. It's fucking hilarious. You he's, like can, he's like fucking sweating. You, that's he's like red. Yeah, he's like clearly been injecting roids, and it's like that's the body you get when you you do roids and you go to the gym like twice a week. It's fucking <laughs> so funny. It's such a funny picture. Just red. Just. It is. <laughs> oh my. Picture of it, like, full face up to the camera. Oh so god, so good. Um, oh, what's the video? Fucking um, my my uh. One of my friends from high school, um, who actually lives on this floor now, uh, show it would always show everybody the video on Japan the uh, explanation of Japanese culture video. <laughs> it's one of the fun it's so funny. And he like makes it on like, a shitty webcam. It's fucking hilarious. Oh, is that the one where he's like showing them Nanking videos or something? Or no, that's an inconvenient no, anime. No. no, no, he's like, um he's talking uh to the camera and he, and he starts out genuine and he's like you know, he's talking about, uh, he, he's just bullshitting basically for the, I'm pretty sure the whole thing is like, uh, an improv bit. And yeah. then he gets to the point of just doing like racist impressions. Like, <laughs> like, like, he, he starts out and, he, and then he starts talking about Asian women and then he goes into how they have soulless eyes. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's like, maybe it's cause, maybe I'm attracted to them because she looks like a 12 year old. <laughs> it's like, and she, he just goes on a complete fucking tangent and starts laughing. Oh my um, God. <laughs> I mean, you don't, if, as long as you don't take any of that shit, like, as, as something you should A, believe, or take, like, seriously, yeah. I think it's fine. It's great. Yeah, no, Bailey, no, did, uh, no. did you retweet the post that I did announcing you? Yes. Oh, you did. Good. Okay, good. Good stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure I did, Dolan. Let me, let me make sure. Yeah. Uh, fuck Hail it. to the king, baby. Where is it? Uh, where is it? Uh, I think it should be the second yeah there it is nice there it is very good yeah. very and good. uh <laughs> somebody said um she's hot and then said wait right afterwards oh that classic <laughs> bit yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> uh let me see here yeah okay yeah yes i did retweet it very good, good. ah <sighs> i hope i'm not being a fuck horrible guest i know no, you're you i'm having the time of my life you're a really good guest we have we have good <laughs> guests on here
No, you're being wonderful. Yeah. Um. Whew, how many times have you? How many times have you played like New Vegas? Um. I so here's the thing. Like, it's one of those games that I just play and then I quit after a certain point. Mm-hmm. Like, I'll start up a brand new playthrough. I'll be really into it, and then I'll get to the point where you got to go and talk to the boomers. And, mm. my, and my, yeah. Oh, and I'm just like, all right, this playthrough's finished. Yeah. No. Fucking hate the boomers. I like. I think I like every other faction besides the boomers. That's like, yeah. I, I, the what is it? The uh, the legion. Yeah. Uh, just because you can blow them up. <laughs> you like the legion. You like the legion because you want to be like their boy slave. No, I never said that. <laughs> yeah, you did. I had to cut it before it aired, but you you were talking about that for like a good five seconds. You're putting words in my mouth. No, I, I'm no, I'm airing your thoughts. This what is you... going into my community forum thread. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be clipped and then saved to my future Kiwi forum thread. Oh gonna God, be like, no. they're gonna be like, Yo, why did he why did he say that shit? Yo, what the heck? This what? freaking guy is real is into into this shit. Yo, what the hell? Next clip and be like, What the heck is this? Damn it! Now that I've brought it up, they're probably gonna watch. Yeah, it. no, it's we're gonna like materialize it. <laughs> I am, I am in uh in a Kiwi Farm set. They posted a screenshot of me and uh, this. Uh, do you know? Did you know who Smug Ryuka was? I do. Yeah, they were in my Discord, yeah. and I had I booted them out immediately. They're fucking insane, dude. Oh. <laughs> they Just... um they posted a picture of this comic that was like a web comic or something, and it yeah. was like um. Uh, what is it? Is it the shoplifting one? No, no. Uh, that, well, one's... that one I feel bad about because, like, I, I yeah. got, yeah, I, I joined in a pylon on that. that person. Yeah. Um, but no, they they tweeted, it was like a comic of about a nerdy Hail person, like, making king, friends. Baby. Like yeah. a nerdy girl making friends with normal girls or something. Yeah. And she was like, this is not how it works. I would could never make friends. And, and then she, like, she... She's like saying that it's like offensive and shit, and I was like, "That's kind that of a cell phone." It's like <laughs> I couldn't make friends. You're just unlikable. Yeah, exactly. It's like, chill. You're you're I like I hate to be that person, but you are an unlikable person, and you probably weren't like just because you had a bad experience does not mean that everybody like this person is lying. Yeah, no, like, there's like there's certain people who just. Like, I, I, this is kind of advice that I give people, but if you're getting online solely to get pissed off, like, you're gonna make yourself depressed. Yeah. Uh, no, I, I replied to it, and I said, this is when I was really small. I had, like, maybe 300 followers. Literally. And I, and I replied to it, and I said, um, no, people didn't like you because you're an unlikable bitch. Uh, <laughs> I, I... And then she quote retweeted it, and then we got into a fucking <laughs> Twitter debate <laughs> argument shit where I, she, she was like, why are you calling me this? And then, and then I was like, no, you're just a bitch. What? And I was oh like, I have a Smagruko is the best word. That's fucking, and, uh, yeah. I, Korean, Russian, I was Jewish, looking back and I think Spanish, one of your, uh, British, American, one of your first Japanese, posts Cuban to me was race, like uh, commenting on a Twitter. selfie that I did and being like, yo, you have like oh. no life in your eyes, dude. <laughs> no, I said you are the, I said you look exactly like a dude. <laughs> it was like the first time I'd ever seen you. That, yeah, the first time people ever saw what I like, I looked like, and they're always like surprised that I'm normal looking. Yeah. <laughs> like, no, that was at, like um, uh, I think 200 followers like posted that. And I, I also posted about. I think I watched your Justin. Didn't you have Justin Wang on? Once? I did. Yeah. Yeah, I think I watched that stream. That was a good ass stream, man. We should get a Justin back on. I don't. Justin is a great guy. Uh, although I have never talked to him, even though he follows me because I drew a fan art. I think he, I think he just follows people if they add him once. He like yeah no he he retweets us all, like me and Serb all the time and like yeah we our posts go into strange places. Yeah, uh, he's probably muted me by now, but he's. A... Yo, what? <laughs> I didn't know what you. I think I I think I followed you for a while without knowing what you look like. I don't know how that happened, but like I. I remember I was like, yo, what the, that's what you look like? Jesus, you, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, it was very weird to have, because I drew, like, fan art for a bunch of people that were, like, um, that did, like, porn shit. Um, and then I posted a picture of myself, and they were like, what the fuck is, what? <laughs> and then they, they said that I was on, it was very nice, and it, it uh, gave me a, a big boost in self-confidence. That's how you gotta do it. basically, like, poor posting, so. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's, yeah, start of darkness, that's what that is. 
I, well, I, you know, they got me close. They, they never said I should, mm. but your proxy, they got me close to starting an OnlyFans. Never, don't, don't do that. Me. Bailey, you could do modeling, but they don't deserve it, you know? No, no, I would never. I would never. Don't, um, don't do that shit. I was talking I to you. I, ugh. there's just, I, I've you, talked to people about that and they're like, yeah, give me body issues. It gave me all the shit. And I already have that stuff, so I don't need, I, oh, that. God. Don't go doing that shit. No. I, I am good. Uh, I can get a job normally. I have <laughs> like, like, oh, a normal job. There's like a, a mutual that I have on Twitter. I think I impressed him with my follow count, and now we're like on Grinder, and now we're mutuals. But like mm -hmm. he, he's like, yeah, I have like an OnlyFans, and I just like post two pictures a month, and like somehow people keep giving me money, and it's like, yeah, but <laughs> on the other hand, you, yeah, you've you've got to pretend to be like, oh, hey, I'm a base trap, everybody, and it's like that, that's kind of. Yeah. I don't want to do that. Don't don't no. do that. I, I I don't want to feel like I I owe any owe anybody my body, which is what it feels like. It, yeah, uh, it feels gross to me. I, I'm not saying anybody who's already doing it should feel bad about this. I, I am I'm actually like saying that. Yeah. So I I okay. will. <laughs> I I Bailey's not saying that, but I am. I am I am friends with so many of those people. That oh, they're they're good people. I'm not I'm not like shitting on them or anything. No no no. Um, I, I love them deeply, and if they're, you know, a lot of them are very happy with, you know, their, like, but, um, you know, some of them, some of them do not like it. Uh, oh. Yeah. God. No, it's, um, it's a depressing, it's kind of depressing. If, if you do not enjoy it, it is fucking depressing. Oh. That kind of sucks. You kind of get, like, I think you probably get, like, trapped in it, kind of. Like, yeah. Uh, I know, you know, Willa didn't do it for a long time, but, she, uh, they used to do it. Yeah. Um. And think they, they stopped doing it, but people still like will say like shit about them on fucking LGBT and shit. Yeah. Uh, and that'll like cause her to freak out. Oh. Um. Yeah. I don't. I don't talk to her that much anymore. But well, I, I don't talk to her anymore. Oh. <laughs> but. But uh, you know, yeah, she she had uh, she struggled with that stuff. So. God. They'll. I mean, yeah, they'll say any shit on LGBT. LGBT is hell. LGBT is um, like, there's an alarming amount of, of like Brisbane people, like where I live, who are on LGBT. I guess it's because there's nothing to do here. There's a lot of like very eccentric gays here, which is like, I go on Grinder and there's like five femboys, which is bizarre because most like for the most part, the Grinder experience for most people is like old men. Yep. And yep, it's that's yeah, exactly that's and I've got like yeah, it's weird. It's, it's, it is uh, it is miserable and fucking the, in the south. I, I don't know maybe if, if it's better somewhere else, but dude, it fucking sucks. Oh, in the south. I that, shit. that sounds pretty horrible, but, man. No, it's uh, I mean, whatever. It's not like I, I want to use it anyway. It's kind of like I don't really enjoy using it that much anymore. I don't, I, yeah, I don't, I don't enjoy using it, but like sometimes you're just lonely and horny. I, I keep making friends through it, and it's like I, I'm not using this right. I mean, if you're making friends, it's probably better than fucking nothing. Like, it's, it's that's that's better than making it like a connection for like five minutes and then leaving. It is, yeah. I mean, yeah. No, that's um. No, that's probably healthy. If you're making friends off of it, fuck it, whatever. Yeah. Fuck no. it. Fuck it. I'm meeting cool people, I guess. Yeah, you meet some fucking oddballs on that. Oh that, yeah, no, I. I something that disappointed me was like, finding out that normie gays exist. Yeah, they suck, dude. It's, it's like, them. oh, man. Like, I thought, oh, I've been liberated. I never have to pretend to like The Office again. It's like, oh, no. You're going to no. you're gonna meet Queer Eye gays now. Oh, they suck. You're going to, oh. Them, them and drag queen gays are fucking miserable to talk to. I hate it so much. It's like, I just kill myself. It's like have you seen the movie 1408? Uh, I think that's the one about the uh, the, the haunted. haunted it's like that part in that movie where john cusack thinks he's gotten out of the room but then it turns out he yeah, never left yeah, and it's yeah, like yeah. i was out i was out it's like i was out yeah. i thought i was out yes you know there are way more of those honestly there are probably way more um cringy normie gays than there that, are that, fu that's fu that shouldn't be a thing gay people should be interesting i agree I, I would like it if uh, if that's how it was, but you know whatever. Oh. Uh, uh, they, yeah, having people tell you that you should be a drag queen constantly is kind of fucking depressing. Oh. <laughs> I don't want to be told that. I fucking hate that shit. Like, 
That shit makes me feel fucking nasty. Oh god, that kind of sucks. I mean, it's kind of, I don't know, it's probably like just self hating to a certain extent, just because like, you know, I, I, I don't like that type of shit, but also, I just don't like that type of shit. Like, yeah. I, I, don't, I would much rather talk to a straight dude than most gay dudes. Oh, man. Yeah. No, I, I, it does, it does suck when you just like, because obviously I'm still like a baby gay, but it, when you, yeah. you meet like other gay people and there's like, oh, we both have this in common. And then it's like, you just talk to them and you're just nothing alike. Yeah. And it's like, oh, yeah. it must be even worse than when you're like trans. Yeah. It's, uh, that shit would be, f I, I don't know. I, I just, I, I don't, I haven't gotten on like any, like any dates, like ever. No, like, I literally. Haven't. I think I think I've gone on once one and it ended in the chick telling me that she ripped her ex's belly button ring out and I was like ah uh, I'm good yeah I'm good no I, I'm good I yeah I was like smoking weed with like a local trans girl and she was just like telling me that she was dating like uh, another trans girl solely because she was uglier than she was and I was just like what the fuck what I was like um, what why would you do that? I don't fucking. I was like, yo, I, I don't think we should like hang out anymore. <laughs> like, that sounds really gross. That sounds like fucking. I mean, I'm not gonna say abusive because your relationship was like, but like kind of. And it was weird. It, it's just like, yo, it's like, yeah, you're dating someone so you could like feel better about yourself. It's like, how bad yeah. must you be? That's really fucking shitty. Jesus Christ. <laughs> no, it was like I was like my jaw legit dropped. I was like, what? I was like, okay. We, I, yeah, no, like, we, you gotta look after each other. You can't be doing that. Yeah, you're not supposed to be like, yeah, my, my partner looks like shit. My partner is... Yeah, like, oh, my partner, yeah, horrible looking. <laughs> really mean, Jesus Christ. I, it was just, yeah. And I, I was... Somebody has high school brain. And dude, yes, that's, uh, oh, right. God. That's like fucking dating the dating the less popular guy so that then you can like have them cling on to you yeah no it was it was it was like some high school girl shit just that's really gross mm, no just yeah no tons of red flags for that person like they were like boasting about stealing from like hookups houses and it's like yeah you know what i'm good uh, yeah no they they like greened out on weed and i just like threw them in the car drove them home and dumped them home and then blocked them <laughs> it's like yeah you can, you can go away Oh, dude. Okay, have you have you ever greened out? Uh, no. Actually, I'm I'm pretty good with weed. I get like spins and I gotta lay down. But like, I. You can't handle food? weed. I'm gonna guess. No, no, I can now. Well, I might. I don't smoke. I refuse to smoke now. But mm -hmm. I do edibles. A lot no impurities. Now. They make me feel really good. Yeah, edibles make me feel great. I love edibles. Um, they make. Apparently, my roommate has told me that they made me like. They make me act gayer. Oh, I've seen that. I saw that video where you were like, oh, I'm so high. You were cute as fuck in that. Not gonna lie. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, how the fuck did I manage to post this? I was faded as fuck that night. Oh, um, you made some funny posts. But uh, when I, I I took a rip off a bong while we were in the middle of the woods. um, And like at first, because bongs are like instant, whereas edibles take. Mm-hmm. But I took a rip off it, and then, have you ever had the thing where, like, lights start coming into your eyes, like, squares? I think so. What, like, floaters? No, it feels like you're rendering the world. <laughs> you're <laughs> rendering? <laughs> oh, God, you took, Bailey, you took the low-poly drugs. <laughs> Bailey, you're taking... That's exactly, yeah. <laughs> I, um, I started to see the world in fucking pixels and shit, and, like, lights started coming in, in like, literal blocks. Uh, and then, like, I started, I started doing the thing where, like, my teeth chattered and, oh. like, my, my jaw crunched up. Yo. And, like, I, like, I, I, so it was, like, a panic attack mixed Hail with to the high. King, mm, baby. Oh, God. Uh, One of the things yeah, I like to I get, get... I get frame drops, exactly, yes. You get frame, um, yeah, Bailey starts, like, clipping into the wall. You're just like, ah, <laughs> get him out. I mean, that's kind of how it feels. You, you, like, I, I would pull my phone out and try to open it and try to, like, unlock it. And then I would pass out. And yeah. then I'd, I'd, I'd wake up and it'd be like... It will be like two seconds later and be like, oh shit, my phone closed. I yeah, guess I'll start that. you're just like talking, you're talking to like your roommate about what happened last night. They're like, yo, Bailey, you were trying to clip out of the map, dude. Bailey, <laughs> you you were trying to get out of bounds. Yo, dude, you were no clipping, bro. Bro, you were fucking, you fucking no clip through the wall, dude. You did it. 
It's, it's just like in reality, you were just like walking around with your eyes closed. I'm, I'm walking into a wall. I'm having a scripting error. You're just, you're just like making the doom guy. Mm, 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 sound. <laughs> <laughs> There's a picture of it where all my friends are gathered around me, and I've got like my hands, my hands like all clenched up because like you could see the veins like oh, pulsating man. out. Like I couldn't open them; they were in like the claw position. Yeah. Uh, Bailey, you gotta, you gotta. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. Sorry, finish. Oh no, no you're good. You're, uh, you gotta talk about like something I've noticed is that you, you post about all like the gay shit you did in high school as if that was something everyone did. I thought that was hilarious. That all right? Okay. All right. Listen. Whipping, all right, and an all boys school. What mm -hmm. kind of school did you go to? I went, I went to a uh, mixed sex school, so mixed sex school. Okay, so you went to go. All right. Yeah, we had we had a lot of sexual assaults. We didn't have gay shit. Yeah, we had that at co-ed school too. When I, I went to a co-ed school for two years of my high school career, and then I went to an all boys school for two years. Mm -hmm. So I got the contrast. Um, co-ed, you get a lot more drama. All boys, you basically get no drama unless somebody gets into a fucking full-on fist fight. Mm -hmm. Uh, and and people will hold knives up to your throat as jokes. Oh man! Is, no no no! It was funny. It was funny. The guy who did it was that's I, I, yeah. Like, I knew he wouldn't. Me. Just the uh, kind of, yeah the kind of shit that boys do when girls aren't around is just so funny. It's great. Um, I had a friend who would uh, this is the same friend by the way, who would who would fucking he would whip his nuts out in the middle of science class while the teacher was looking. <laughs> whiteboard and then he would tap on my shoulder and like like be like hey you dropped your pencil and then i'd look down and just, fucking nuts would be out and <laughs> yeah, what are you looking at my nuts for faggot yeah, I'd be like you're fucking gay bro you're looking at my fucking you just like do that thing where you like you you like point down and they look at your dick and like yo why are you looking at my dick dude yo you're fucking gay yeah no i whip my ass out so much dude oh so god like, me while we were walking through the school stairway i did that shit all the time this um, just yeah there's that picture my, of you with like your asshole out for some reason. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm on my homie's couch. They're, they were all fucked up on lean, so they didn't know. So I showed them that picture a day later, and they were like, "What? Well, you had your asshole out for that?" <laughs> um, fucking uh, what was it? Um, oh, we did a um in, in our class in our English class, we would do a thing where we'd all gather around in a circle and then be like. Uh, do the stupid, like, let's go type thing, but, yeah. like, for our teacher or whatever, because we thought it was funny. Oh, and got man. really annoyed about it. Jesus. But one day, while the teacher was gone, uh, I whipped, I, I had my nuts out, and I got in the circle. Yeah. And I had my hand in the circle, and I was waiting for somebody <laughs> to notice it. <laughs> and they just never did until they all, they all had their hands up at the end of it, and one of them was Jake, do you have your nuts out? I was like, oh! <laughs> it's just one of those things where, like, they don't, re they just, people don't notice, like, things. Yeah, yeah. You, you've had your nuts out the whole time and no one noticed. Everybody, like I said, at an all-boys school, everybody's seen everybody's nuts. I'm telling you the truth here. All right, that, not everybody. Uh, I was thinking, of, yeah, just, just heterosexual men just doing gay shit and not thinking it's gay. Like, what, like, we were at, like, a sleepover and, like, yo, what if we all, like, what if we found out who had the biggest dick? <laughs> it was like that was something we did and we didn't think I it never, was gay i literally never did that you didn't oh. I, I i would whip my ass out. so i had um i had a vr headset that i would bring to my friend's house so mm -hmm. we could play with it uh and i would have people put it on for beat saber and then i would whip my ass out and stand in front of them oh man and, and then uh fucking yeah yeah <laughs> Yeah, and then and then they would pull it up and they'd see my ass and I'd be like, "Damn, I got your ass." Got your ass, Which, bro. Not very funny, but it was funny in the moment. It was funny it was in the funny. moment. Then you're just like, "Bro, that was gay as hell." <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. Yo, I, was, I, I, I um I was friends with a lot of theater kids. Oh, I okay. I have a confession to make. I was a theater kid in high school. This is the oh. this is the worst thing I will reveal about myself. I did drama in high school. Yeah. Yeah, the signs were there. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, no, I I was very good at drama. I wasn't a theater kid per se. I didn't like musicals or any of that shit. Oh yeah, no, I fucking hated musicals. No, I only did it because I was like good at AD. I like I I had ADHD and like I I could make funny faces. Yeah. And that was that was yeah that was my in. But like, wh what about you? What did you what were you what did you excel at in high school? I, uh, art, I guess, kind of, yeah, yeah. um, 
I did t-shirt designs. I well, okay, so my um I, I excelled at art and I excelled at doing like bits to piss off teachers. Oh and god, shit. just doing shtick. Yeah, we used to um <laughs> we used to have uh like school speeches and shit. Yeah. And like visitors would come and talk. Yeah. Um and it, usually like sometimes they'd have like a question and answer section. And most people would answer them with like a corny joke mm-hmm. or with like, you know, a genuine question. And yeah. uh, I stood up one day. We had a zoo. A lady from the zoo come over, and she she uh, she was like showing off animals and shit. Yeah. And she brought like a, a rat, mm-hmm. uh, and it was pretty it was pretty cute. Yeah. Uh, but I I stood up. This is like at the beginning of the year, so most people didn't like know me that well, but they knew that I dicked around a lot. Yeah. And I I asked them um, uh, how, what was the best way to get rid of uh, the rats in my car, like. That I- <laughs> Like a fucking rat infestation eating the wires of my car. <laughs> um, and uh, and then from that point on, I was known as the kid who asked about the fucking rats in their car. Yo, that's a serious problem, oh, yeah. man. Oh, that yeah. was a sincere question. And the second one uh, was um, this this dude came and talked about um, like the bet. He was like a he's like a business major, I think. And he, but he wasn't even talking. He was like one of those self help fucking dickheads. Yeah. And he was talking about like you know the the ways to success and shit. Yep. And so I asked him uh, the best way to get a girlfriend, <laughs> in like the most Chris Chan voice. I oh my god, it's the guy. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. No, I'm busy. Oh. Hey, give me a sec. <laughs> You're gonna accidentally shoot him. <laughs> this is the geckos just oh, waiting. Yo, what were you saying? Go back to how to get a girlfriend. Yeah, I asked him. Uh, I asked him how to get a girlfriend. How, best way to get a girlfriend in like the most Christian voice I could do. Uh, and people, a, a bunch of people fucking laughed, and a couple teachers laughed. But after that, uh, the teachers got pissed off at me for asking questions. And so I was. Uh, they said if I did it again, that I would get. Uh, I would not be able to make any any uh, speeches for the school like during homecoming and shit. Uh, so I decided to take the L and, uh, wait for Homecoming to do offensive bits. That's how you gotta and they do it. Even let me do that. I had a full, um, I had a full, uh, PowerPoint done. Uh, and the whole bit was, um, it was my, it was basically just a dating profile that was going to present to the whole, like, like class basically. But it was just like a bunch of stupid shit. Like I had, uh, I had a slide that was, um, things I don't like in women. <laughs> Or things I don't like in a woman, and then the next slide is just in big, bold, black text, uh, talking. And, then <laughs> and uh, my teacher said that that wasn't okay and that I couldn't do it. And so I got, I was like, okay, I guess I won't do it. I guess I won't do the shit that I spent like a f- fucking, like, two days working on dickhead. <laughs> oh my god. But, uh... <laughs> <laughs> got his ass. Got his ass. <laughs> The, get, the, the gecko oh, just yeah. ran away. <laughs> Jesus, do you have a fucking gore mod on, bro? I do, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I was like, is that fucking more blood? Yeah. I remember it being very small. <sighs> Can I get some water real quick? Yeah, go ahead, I'm man. Alright, I will be right back. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, did I didn't, Jay. No, oh, Shep, do you want to speak? Yeah, speak, man. Speak your truth. We want to hear you. Here, take, the, take the headset. Here. Sit down, cause the mic's. Just don't say the N word, please. Say anything offensive, I swear to God. More offensive than what I already said. Fine. <laughs> all right, this is where you can tell us all the uh, embarrassing things about Jake. All the embarrassing things about. Jake. Yeah, we we got a hundred people here. We want to know. Okay, well that's not that many. Um, uh, I got you. Jake snores. Really? Oh shit! He's finished. What? We got your ass. Fuck, I do. Yes. So Jake is a very uh, tiny man. Oh uh, yeah, Fuck yeah. You guys. Big set of lungs. <laughs> it's impressive. It's impressive. Are you, are you bit or do I actually snore? No, you don't. No. I don't. I. All men okay. snore, Bailey. It's a thing. All right. What else we got here? Um. <laughs> he's afraid of water. What? You man. You're making up yeah. shit now. No, no, no. Talk about how. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's crazy. Okay, so when he's not snoring or hiding from showers, what? He is 
Um, Farting excessively. How many people have we got in here? There's just like half the dorms in here listening to Bailey talk about his balls. <laughs> what else? What do you guys want to know about Jake? Uh, okay, chat, chat. What do you want to know about uh, Bailey? This is this is your t just read the chat. Do you see the chat box? Yes. Okay, you can. Yeah, here we go. We all see him tested for rabies. Yeah. Um, tell us about the steroid journey. Well, they're currently journeying here from a factory in Vietnam. Nice. So, I will update you on that. This is fascinating. I, l I love when we get like characters coming into the stream. Bailey's roommates. The lore thickens. It truly does. How long do his femboy photo shoots take, and are you oh, present? He has room for that. Oh, he's. Uh, oh, no kidding. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm back. All right, yeah, no, we're just asking about all the uh, gay shit you do in front of people. A lot of it is based on the lighting. Mm -hmm. uh, from the sun. What's going uh, on? And here? occasionally the moon. Yes. Oh. Uh, Nightwolf. Nine. Do you find that Bailey gets gayer at night? Is that a thing? I do have, well, uh, yes, probably, it, it really, um... How long do his femboy photo shoots take? Not that long. It, it ranges. I'll yeah. say between an hour and four hours. It's like, it's like a bank robbery. You gotta be in and out within 15 minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah, even totally. do them while you're here. Um, <laughs> yeah, uh, you know, I get kicked out and then I, I wait in the hallway. One to four hours. And the dude's walking by on a photo shoot and I'm like, photo shoot. Oh, my roommate's being gay. All right, you can get off now. I'm fucking all right, back. All right. all right, we've learned. We've learned so much. Uh, all right, Bailey, I'm updating the wiki as we speak. This is all going straight to Kiwi Farms. Yeah, dude. Yeah, all right, I'm back. Headphones back on. Headphones back on. Tail in. <laughs> Butt plug tail in. <laughs> My socks on. Stockings on. You're ready to program. <laughs> hmm. Mm -mm. I never got that. I tried to code Unity. I'm yeah. stupid. You got that bimbo so brain. Mm -hmm. Yep. You know, many cases like right. that. Yeah. You try to use a computer, you're just like, oh, I can't figure this out. <laughs> this internet thing is so complicated. Stop sexualizing me. I can't help it. <laughs> no. No, don't sexualize no, me. No, don't sexualize me. Likes, no. No, no, I don't like it. <laughs> uh, okay. I would say I have the least bimbo brain out of anybody that fucking fembo, femboy posts on Twitter. I This is a disturbing trend I've noticed. Is like you'll talk to a femboy and then it'll be like, oh, what do you do in your spare time? Like, oh yeah, I go to university. I'm studying like law. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like, right. yeah, it happens every time. Oh yeah, I'm a, I'm a rocket scientist. And, and in my spare time, I, I like to be a sissy. <laughs> yeah, uh, when I'm a, when I'm around straight people, they uh, make me wish I was a girl. It's like, what the fuck? You're a rocket scientist. <laughs> you're you're a rocket scientist. <laughs> you do this in your spare time. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, yeah, they're just really really okay. A lot of them are really fucking smart. Yeah, they're just like, kind of bad socially. Yeah, it's the uh, the tism. Mm -hmm. Like um, I know uh. Willow's really, really smart about philosophy and shit. Yeah. Um, she's obsessed with fucking Chinese communism, though. That's which, the thing that, yeah. A lot of them are obsessed yeah. with Chinese communism. I can't get people in my Discord to stop talking about fucking dengism. <laughs> it's just like, please. Please, please shut up. Please just talk about games. <laughs> Still, it's I better. Really would. Yeah, it's better than what usually I, happens in Discords. <laughs> I just want people to talk about how cute video game characters are, or just do bits. That's exactly it. Not talk about, like, what certain group of people need to throw, be thrown in gulags for re fucking correction or facilities Please. or whatever the fuck. They said, they said that in an ideal world, I would be fucking, like, a, uh, a, what is it, re-education facility. Hell yes. I was like, what the fuck? I don't really... Yeah, trapped in <laughs> being sent gross. to one of, sent to one of Obama's sissy cubes. <laughs> Sit. Oh, have you seen the fucking um? Do you, uh, have you ever watched like? I'm guessing you did. Did you watch Mr. Mediker? Mr. Mediker? I maybe. What's hang on? Talk about it. I think I know what it is. He just does like um. 
Oh yeah, that guy, the internet aristocrat guy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think that yeah, guy. I briefly watched him back when I was like younger. Mm -hmm. Same with me. I don't watch him anymore. I'm just not like. I just don't care. Don't care about that shit no more. I don't give a shit. But he did a nostalgia critic series, which is pretty funny. Oh my god. Uh, I did. Like those. Um. What the fuck was I talking about? Oh, he posted a thing about um the fucking the the work cubes <laughs> sleep yeah. and then the butt thing and he was like this is the future <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> this is what you have to look forward to oh my you're God. going to be eating cockroaches living in a fucking it living in a box and then you come out of your box to work in your work cube oh and you're fed God. like a hamster I was yeah I was reading about like work conditions at Google and how like people just come to work with like these greasy programmer types just come to work with like tails attached and stuff. Dude, is that fucking true? Yeah, like they they're they're like really autistic like furries that are really good with tech. Oh my god, I'm being chased hey. by scorpions. That's fucking disgusting, dude. Oh man. I figured your like Discord would be like that for sure. No, my Discord's like I got the one good Discord. It's like see Discord is like you either get like a really good one or it just turns into like trans women meeting oh. and fucking in flyover states. But like No, dude, the um, the Discord um what's it called? Uh uh fucking di the, like the actual Discord management, like the people who are running Discord. Oh. I figured that would be how their offices would be. Oh man, have you I guess you don't follow Chapo, but if you knew what their Discord was like, where it no, I know what I know, Chapo, but I do. Oh, know. oh, that Discord is that I Discord. I think that subreddit too just turned into like a trans hookup thing. What? It will do it. Look, any online space. It's like, ha have you ever seen the movie The Thing? Yeah. Okay. There's a part where like he brings he he brings the dog into the kennel and then he walks yeah. away and then the dog like explodes and starts eating the other dogs. And it's a little bit like that. They just like they they come in and they just start sucking and fucking, and then more of them, and then more of them, and then more of them. Before you know it, it's like it's just a tra it's just this trans hookup thing. That's what happened to that subreddit. <laughs> oh, dude! Oh, I gotta talk to you about um. There was um some some there's some there's this one Discord. I forgot what it was called exactly, but it was called like Welcome trap something or some <laughs> fucking bullshit. <laughs> And everybody that I'm friends with from the internet was in that Discord. And also, there's like a huge, I saw a fucking image macro of it, and it's horrific, dude. Oh. That shit's fucked. That shit is fucked. Is it like, is it the one where it was like that one person who was making people like cut their name into themselves? Oh, I know that guy though. Mm -hmm. or, well, I don't know the guy, but I do know what you're talking about. Yeah, I, you gotta, you gotta talk more about this, this Discord thing, because I haven't heard of this. I gotta find the image macro. I probably won't be able to. Um, but in general, it was just fucked. It's like, it's, you know, it's people... Uh, actually, I think it might have been, like, an offshoot of that one. Because oh, I man. think that was the main one. And then there's an offshoot of it where people just post, like... Man. Uh, like, themselves and shit, and it's really depressing. Oh, no. There's an image macro of it, and it was, like, people shitting in diapers and stuff. And oh, like, no. Fuck? God, you need to have... People need to have shame in their lives. I do agree to a certain extent, yeah. Yeah. Uh, the di anything to do with poop or pee is fucking that, yeah oh gross. god it is upsetting i hate it it's really nasty oh lord um what uh fucking i'm i'm mad because i haven't gotten to do a single one of those fucking hookups ever <laughs> but also i don't really everybody everybody that i'm consider that like is near me is in a relationship Oh, that hurts, man. You just see, you feel like Elliot Roger. You're like, damn. No, I just, I'm I, in a relationship. I'm oh, in a relationship now. Yo. I get but it. It's a point where I was not. Yo. And you just like, <laughs> you felt like sad seeing other people happy. You were just like, oh. Yeah. I, yeah. I wish that you just. Now like, I'm. Yeah. Now I'm fine. Like a year ago, I would have been like pissed off, and now I just want someone to like cuddle me. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Exactly. That's literally. I'm not at all fucking horny. Ever. No, I don't even. Yeah, no, I don't even want to fuck. No, I just want like, damn, it would I mean, be nice. I can, just, I, I can just beat off. Yeah, and be fine. That's that's how it be. Like, you know, I fucking it. It's it's not that hard. It ain't hard. <laughs> uh, uh, 
and people people who do like hookups obsessively, I think they need to learn. Their the hands. those like big grinder gays, the what the Chad types. I think they I, the ones that I've met like not like for sex, but just like in person. They tend to have like really big self esteem problems. Yeah. Like they have like body image issues and all all sorts of shit. They're just very neurotic. Caravan mm. citizen. Yeah. They are. Um, yeah. They. I think. I think a lot of people do hookups to uh, boost their confidence. To a it, yeah, that's why people are on Grinder anyway. It's just really depressing. I might get off it because it's like really bad. It's bad for my self esteem. Like I just feel bad. I mean, if it actually is damaging your self esteem, fuck it, dude. Totally. Yeah. Totally. No. Really know. It's it's just like. You'll message someone who like appeals to you in a lot of ways, and they just won't message back, and you're just like, oh. Like uh, I, I'm, I'm no yeah. oil painting, but like, yeah. You're a good-looking guy, bro. Oh, thank you. You're a good-looking guy. Well, thank you, Bailey. That means a lot coming from you. I'm gonna pat you on the head. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, if I, if you saw me in person, you'd say I look like a ghoul. <laughs> ghoul, <laughs> ghoul. I, ha I have, I have, but. I happen to like ghoulish men. <laughs> I look like a goblin. How tall are you? Wait, how tall? Uh, are you? I'm six foot four. Fuck, oh, you're tall. Okay, I'm, I'm big as okay, shit. I'm That's yeah. Man. I've met so many people that are like five four, like that I know online. I'm like, I thought you'd be taller. No, Rosie, no. Um, yeah. Rosie, Rosie is like five. How six. the fuck did this? Go what happened to this dude? Why did he? He fell like a Family Guy character. What the fuck? <laughs> Yo, what happened yeah, to him? The fucking Family Guy base, uh, the the fucking like base uh, Family Guy falling over. <laughs> yeah, what the hell? Uh, what were you? What were you? I am not grooming Bailey. Bailey is grooming me. I've already been groomed. I was groomed in, high, in early early high school. Yeah, you, Bailey was happened. just like, Yo, I really like this YouTuber. I think I'll go into their Discord. And then actually, what happened? That fuck many <laughs> such many such cases. Many such cases. I joined the um, the Astrosist Discord in when I was sixteen. Yep. And that, and then I got an invitation to a trap Discord from there. Oh God. I got a, I got an invitation to a smaller one from there, and then you know, shit happens. Yes. Uh, and, no. Now. You know, Shit gets fucked. This Shit is this fucked. is this is my story. It's <laughs> it started in a Discord. Oh, I love. Oh, thirteen reasons why season six, and it's about Discord. <laughs> it's oh, like... fuck. that's fucking genius. Thirteen S reasons why, but it's about Discord grooming. Son, why does this Chinese man want to marry you? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. I was talking to Nev, that's uh, Rue Maru, in case you don't know, about, like, um, men who approach her and, like, want to yeah. marry her and shit. And she just gets, like, weird fucking people. <laughs> uh, tell tell, tell Rue Maru to fucking follow me. Get her to... <laughs> no, Rue's pretty surly. The first reason uh, why cool. he made me... She's really cool, yeah. I, yeah. A I, lot... Uh, I'll, yeah. I, oh, go ahead. No, no, you're good. A lot smarter than she lets on, which is pretty funny. Yeah. No, she posts fucking... She's funny, dude. She is. She posts genuinely funny shit, which is, uh... And it's not like... And then me. she deletes it. Yeah, no, she deletes fucking everything she posts after, like, five minutes. That's pretty good. Uh, what were you gonna say? Uh, I was gonna say, um... I think one of my friends was fucking... I don't know. I, I, no, I don't want to get into that, because that's, like, first... Oh, right, right. Somebody else. I don't, I don't want to. I don't want to delve into somebody else's personal life. You don't have to name <laughs> names. We, we, we want the. No, we no. want. We want that dirty drama. Oh no! Don't worry then. <laughs> <laughs> it involves both. It involves both parties. I, I, they, they, I don't think either one wants me to fucking. I mean, it's not. It's not bad shit. I just. I don't know if it's public or not. Oh right, right. Okay. Yeah. All right. I, I have no idea if it's stuff or not. So I, I would rather not. Fair enough. Uh, yeah. Dead. Uh, this cannot hold. Oh shit! Have you played the Left 4 Dead 2 uh, DLC? Yeah, I have, man. Is it fucking good? It's, I've been thinking about reinstalling. Yeah, it's actually pretty dope. Oh yes. I it's, know it's pretty short, apparently. It's pretty short, but like, yo, new content, man. I would buy a new one. I would oh. buy Left 4 Dead 3. No, I don't know what the fuck they would. Oh, do. Bailey, we forgot to take the perk that makes you gay. Wait, is that a thing? That is a thing. It's a confirmed bachelor. 
Oh yeah. There's, I remember that. There is literally a perk in this that makes you gay. Hail oh, yes. to the king, no. baby. Fuck. Whatever. Oh, we'll get it next. We'll get, we'll get it on the next yeah. level. Yeah. Appreciate the help. Wish I had Rocky more. is confirmed bachelor. No, no, no. So, somebody said great diaper post. Who? Wait, who's Sneak Snakes? Lucas's GF. Sneak Snakes, yes. you a winner. Yes, actually. Yeah. <laughs> Lucas is a sweetie. No, no, we're talking about groomer Lucas, the bad Lucas. With the big fat Fuck. nipples. Yeah. Oh God, we just we just got you. Oh, Fuck. got you There's on a hot mic. Lucas. There's another Lucas that I am dating. Oh, hot mic. Jesus. God damn it. Now Luke, I yeah, Lucas, for... Lucas room, Lucas. You guys better be carving <laughs> oh, this for clips. Oh fuck! I love that picture so much. Oh, it's just, it's those pictures are getting popular. Those elid elegaic aura, or whatever it is. I don't, did I don't know he how you fucking groom somebody. He did. He was a groomer. That's fucking nasty, bro. And he was how well. The he fuck did these people groom people? Well, he was like he had like a very wholesome persona, but he would like groom underage girls. Yeah. I guess that's just how it happens. That's, that's just that's nasty. just how it be. That's how it be. His room looks fucking disgusting, bro. It's like a portal to another world. Yeah, you can see shit rotting from his. Oh, chair. It's so funny. God. <laughs> it looks like he hasn't sat up in days, and his tits are fucking huge. Got, the, got that <laughs> got, got that gyno physique. <laughs> <laughs> My man got that Jeez. gyno. My man got that gyno physique, baby. Oh man, he's fucking nasty. God, I was Ugh. speaking of gyno. I was visiting one of like my friends who, like, a, a really good high school friend who was like they transitioned, but then they kind of were just happy with how they were, so they stopped. But they got stuck with gyno. Ooh. Yeah. So they're they just they just got tits now. They look yeah. feminine. They look oh, fit. Yeah. yeah. My, my friend has that. Um, yeah. Which. What did he do? Take the hair yeah, loss medication. Yeah. Yeah, he got he got off of it, and you know that sucks. Honestly, that must suck. Cause I would, it must yeah. give you like a lot of like it, it give it must give you like a lot of like basically reverse like dysphoria. I guess yeah. Which that's was, that was my favorite Capcom series, uh, Gyno Crisis. <laughs> Gyno Crisis. <laughs> Hell yes. <laughs> uh, I mean, whatever. Fucking you know, it's uh, you 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 gotta. Oh God, you gotta Night Stalkers. Sometimes you're gonna fuck it up in in a certain way, but it's not the end of the world to have have man tits. I guess it's not, is it? Plenty of people have worse shit. Oh yeah, no. You know, I was reading about like there's people on like baldness forums who are taking like those medications and they're like fully tra they're being feminized by them. That's so funny. Have you read about that? That's that's no, that's, that's a thing that's happening is like because of those the hair loss medications they take are like they've got like hormone blockers or something. I don't know. I don't know what they. I don't know what the specifics are, but like yeah, no, they're being like feminized by them. That is so funny. Holy I'll just kill, I'll kill Thomas. Fucking, that's true though. Um, yeah. Hormones keep you from balding. Yep. I think because they they keep like the. Oh the god. Oh gee. Kind of oh god. I'm being murdered. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah, I was. So if you, if you're balding, guys, and you, you know, and you're maybe wor you you think, you know, hey, I, <laughs> I can do that. Just go to go to a your uh. Planned Parenthood. <laughs> uh, I'm not grooming anybody here. Yeah, this is, this Bailey is Bailey is grooming. Anytime he says he's not doing something, I just accuse him of doing it. <laughs> <laughs> I would never groom anybody. I promise. I promise. Bailey, stop grooming my audience. Stop grooming me. <laughs> I can't groom you. You're too high IQ for me to groom. I got, yeah, I'm too smart. You can't go bald if you're a girl. Yes. Yes, it is called male pattern baldness for a reason. Oh, Lord. Uh, actually, my family is, uh, my, I have, I'm lucky. My family has good genes. I'm being I'm chased by, bald. like, night stalkers. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Holy fuck! They're gonna Can kill Oliver. Kiss? No! Whatever. He can. He can die. They're gonna kill Simon from Gurren Lagann. <laughs> what is happening? The Legion. Oh, it's him! It's the fucking uh the. the yeah! 
Good as shit. I will as soon as I stop being chased. Christ. Yeah, you're fucked. No. I don't think they can get in through doors. Uh, Un yes. Unless... Uh, yes, where's my dandelion? Uh, Planned Parenthood does the transitions. Where is my Do dandelion? Products exist? I don't think so, no. That would be very funny, though. Is there a podcast dedicated to grooming? I don't know. The Boy Motor Podcast? <laughs> I listened. I that was how I was like. I knew I was gonna get you on because you were on that and you were really funny. And I was like, yeah, this, this will be a good case. Yeah, I hope. I hope I'm not being uh, too much of a fucking dipshit. No, you're being. This is. This is. You're very on brand for what we want here. Okay, perfect. It's good. You're a good fit. <laughs> you're now. You're now a part of the K Zone lore. Oh yes. I'm. I'm gonna. <laughs> no. Now I'm going to be in this fucking part of the Kiwi Farm store too. God oh, damn it. they're going to find. Yeah, I the thing is, like, I get my tweets get posted in like Kiwi Farm threads about like movie Bob sometimes. And everyone's just like, yo, this guy's funny as fuck. And I'm just like, yeah, cool. Movie Bob is a is such a shit lord. I love fucking laughing at movie. I, Bob. I love him so much. He's just a, he's a character. A real ca Oh, my God. Yeah. Oliver got killed by Night Stalkers. Oh, no. Oh, Man. no. A human monster. <laughs> Oh, it's a blob. he he fucking he just rules. I'm sorry. It's just I love. <laughs> I I don't want to be mean. You can be mean. No, Bailey, this is we're mean here. You go I ahead. Love the biggest laughing socks, uh, on and like I guess, gaming kind of are, a uh, gaming and like film and shit are DSP, who's pretty big. Yep. Uh, fucking Wings of Redemption. Yep. Who's, who's Wings of Redemption? You gotta tell me about this. Have you ever heard of Wings of Redemption? Okay. Maybe. Okay. He's this guy. He used to. He was like a huge COD YouTuber. Yeah. And he did like a bunch of shit with these other guys, and then he kind of uh, died off for because he because he got he started becoming like a, a kind of a shithead. Yeah. Um. And so and people watching him to like get his commentary, they were just watching him <laughs> to piss him off. Oh. Um. And he started playing Rainbow Six Siege. Mm -hmm. And he just fucking hates it. He's miserable at it. And he oh. also sucks at it. Oh, yeah, he gave himself gangrene. What? Yeah. Ow. Yeah. Jeez. I mean, I don't doubt it. That could be incorrect, but I, I wouldn't doubt it. That is um, funny as fuck. Dark side Phil Wade, 400 pounds. Honestly, for, for the guy that he is, I'm very surprised. He, he is a big guy, but uh, he's not that big, honestly. He's kind of just like a, a average schlub. I, I I got I feel like I would see DSP at like a gas station. DSP, yeah. I, I you would you would. Oh God, he beat off twice on camera, but like he's, I don't know what it is. He has like the devil's luck because I think he beat like his taxes or something. Yeah, no, he beat his taxes. He fucking evaded taxes. That's dude. amazing. Like how do you, a normal person could not do that? He is. He wasn't going to be able to pay off his rent, oh. and then fucking Corona happened, so he didn't have to pay his rent. Oh, God. You meet certain people sometimes, and you're just like, this is the protagonist of reality, and I'm just kind of like an NPC. Yeah. And, and DSP is kind of like that. Exactly like that. You He's just... a, um, he has like 100 luck. He does. He's just he has 100 luck and zero charisma. That's just how <laughs> it's got to be sometimes. Ugh. That's just so funny. It's man. so funny that like he jerked off twice and then he could he was able to bounce back. Yeah. Uh, him and what what's fucking what's the last guy Boogie the guy who fucking oh, shot that fucking god Boogie is so funny. <laughs> the fucking oh. picture of his teeth is one of the grossest things I've ever seen. Just this. Oh, the new one, the new ones. No, 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 the ones where he was posting all of his teeth that got taken out. Oh, that's so gross. That dude. was what the f that was. Go You've seen it, right? No, I have not seen that. Oh, seen look, new look that up, Bailey. Jesus. Hold on. Let me look up. Boogie's Boogie. Boogie's teeth. Just United old teeth. That sounds disgusting. <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> you, bro. What the fuck? You see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All of his teeth. My favorite thing is says his new teeth don't fit in his mouth correctly. Yeah, he's like got, they don't oh. look like they're real. He's got like teeth like the the dog from the cover of the seer. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that 
That's exactly what they look like. Oh, fuck. I would be so- Oh, somebody just posted how long do you think it'll take until- Oh my god, until Boogie ruins his dental implants. Oh, how does that even happen? Can you even do that? I don't know. It'd be very funny if you could. Just shot a bird. I- I can't wait. <laughs> um, what's it fucking called? Uh... What was I gonna say? Fucking... Somebody posted something. Oh yeah, the fucking Chris Chris Benoit. Who's that? Um, who's that comedian that Come Town used to make fun of all the time? Uh, Dickfield, Cockfield, or is it Tom Myers? No. Tom Myers. Yeah. Tom. Tom Myers and the guy who did the the fucking uh, Samsung Galaxy. Uh, some. <laughs> oh, I don't. What was that guy's name? <laughs> he was trying to charge his uh his Samsung Dan Ninen. Dan Ninen. Yes. Fucking dickhead. God, that's fucking funny. Jesus. It's fucking hilarious. The, the stand-up oh set that he did where no one is fucking laughing is just oh. It's fucking great. I love. Have you seen the video of the Tumblr girl doing a stand-up set? Is that the one which is that Eve Pizer? Maybe I don't remember her name, but she's wearing like a fucking maybe a Pokemon hat or something. I might like a, some video game or anime hat. I don't know. I, th I think if I know what What's you're her? talking about, Eve Pizer's stand up where she's like reading off her phone and like talking about Alex Jones. Maybe that shit's so yeah. They don't like. I I, I don't think they understand. I I don't know. It's it's so fucking funny to me. No, wait, is it? Is it might yeah, be? It might be. Oh my god. Me and Serb used to make fun of her all the time. No, it is not her, but that's fucking hilarious. Oh I wish God. it was her. Don't worry. Uh, let me look this up. Anime Tom. Oh, here we have the guy with the sexy voice. I want you to witness. <laughs> oh, here it is. Okay, what do we here got? Here it is. I have the fucking. This is like a girl that I would fucking see at like my middle school. Oh. Hold on. I'll post it in general. That shit's so funny. I mean, it's it's horrible. It's it's one of the most wretched things. Jesus, are you in my Discord, Bailey? What am I? What are you in my Discord? Uh, I think so. Yeah, you posted yes, there. I yeah, posted in the general there. Where the fuck is it? Uh, what's it called again? Uh, Kimono Friend Zone. Kim what's this fucking uh, show that I'm on? Hello. What are you on a show? Are you on a show? What? <laughs> what, what? 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 What's the? Oh God! Ah! Oh, the game crashed. Oh, great. <laughs> That's, yeah, we're Perfect. enjoying that New Vegas experience of having the uh, the game fucking break. Yeah, it's exactly we, what I love, we love said, about this game. We yeah, said the name. In general, but it's fucking hilarious. Oh, my God. Okay, how do you think you should start a stand-up set? Like, uh, like, with a good joke? Probably, like... Probably with, a, yeah, I'd say, I'd, I'd say a good joke to ease people in. She, she does... She starts by speaking in Japanese and then goes, oh, wait, I'm not in Japan or some shit like that. What? She's like, uh, it's fucking awful. Hold on. Oh, my God. We might wait. we might have to close out with that one. Jesus. That'll be that'll be a good way to end the show is us just watching that clip. It's like two minutes and 46 seconds long, I think. Oh, my God. It's fucking That sounds awful. appalling. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> just bad. There's like a. Do you know everything is terrible? Uh, I think so. They do like compilation. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. They they yeah, have a yeah. they have a, a special that's all just bad stand up. <laughs> oh, that sounds miserable. I don't think I could. It's all. It's just like the worst stand up from the '80s, and it's like homophobic shit, like Christian comedy. All the just really oh, bad. God. Have Love you ever, that. like, you're probably too young, but have you ever, like, gone back and watched, like, Eddie Murphy's stand-up comedy? King, baby. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going back and watch. I, I don't think I ever watched Eddie, Eddie Murphy's, but I did watch, um... Yeah, because... I watched old, uh, what's his name? The, the fucking, the dude that had, that got a bunch of shit for his new stand-up on Netflix. Mm, oh, you gotta be more specific. The thing with Eddie Murphy's stuff is that, like, those two specials are, like, legendary, and you go back and he's just got, like, a entire segment about, like... Wanting to kill a gay person for looking at his ass. What? <laughs> yeah, no. He's like, all these faggots looking at my ass. And it's just like, yo, <laughs> like I get that it's the 80s. <laughs> Jesus. Bro, chill. Bro. Jesus. 
And that's like a legendary stand-up set. <laughs> yeah, that's, um... That is fucked. Oh, God, that's just... <laughs> No, it's just like you're having a good time, and then he just wheels straight into that. He's like, yeah, I, uh, you know, I, uh, I, I hate gay people. I hate them so much, I, if I could, I'd kill them. <laughs> I would publicly execute them. I, I think we should, uh, kill gay people. My, na <laughs> my name is, uh, Bernie Sanders, and I, I think there should be a, a law that we have to kill gay people. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, it's fucking the Bernie Sanders, um... The, the uh, Bernie Sanders town hall bit that oh, Tom Townsend God. was so fun. <laughs> yes. That is one of my fucking favorites. Oh my God. <laughs> uh, fucking. Oh shit, it's been like two hours. Fuck. Yeah, no, it's, time's flying. It's great. We're having a good time. Yes. Uh, my boyfriend is asking when I, I will be up. So I'll tell him, like. How long you got? I say, like, 45 minutes? That's cool, man. Yeah. Good time. All right, cool. That's how it be. Yeah. Sorry. I, I, no, no, I, it's cool. God. Make him watch this. <laughs> Make him watch the stream. Yeah. <laughs> that way you're technically. You know, yeah. Do you know Luca? I, I, I'm familiar with the name. I, I maybe is he? He's a performer, he's like right? A, uh, like in what? In what? In in the sen in the sense that you would recognize the word performer. Kind of. Okay, I think because I the name is familiar to me. <laughs> Did, okay, in high school, what? How many? Year, how how old are you? I'm 26. So you're 26. Okay. Yeah. So in high school, did you ever have a girl do like, like at a talent show? Do you stand up? No. Like, Wait. I what? Hang on. You cut out a bit there. Did anybody at your school do stand up at a talent? Show? Yes. Was it wretched? It is one of those things where the jokes suck dick, but you laugh politely. Oh, uh, what's up? Uh, my roommate's girl is here. Oh, cool. We got, yo, we got some chicks here. Oh, we're, hey, get her on the mic. Get, uh, you're going to say something offensive, though. <laughs> I'm not going to say, I'm not going to say anything weird. Hey, do you want to be on a stream for a second? <laughs> yeah, sorry. This is, this one's for the boys. Do you actually? Hail to the king, baby. Uh, sure, I don't care. Come over here and sit on the. Sit just on the don't, ma'am. Ma excuse me. Just don't say the n word. Hello. Yes, you can, Jonathan. I'm putting on. We have like 99 people watching. We got like 100 people watching. Just don't say the n word, and you're good. We have 89 currently. Yeah. Here. Women, hello. <laughs> I'm not putting on a woman. Okay, no, 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 no. This is this is the boy zone. What what is a funny story? Kay's, I don't know. This stream is for the boys. I'm sorry. He yeah. Has so many fun shirts. This oh, why do I have so many fun yeah, shirts? Has... I got this one from my uh my theater job. They just gave it away for free. Oh, it, I got one. It's blown shitty, shitty like tech like texture and shit, but uh it is a <laughs> people are saying femoid alert. Femoid. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, there's a girl in here. People on Twitch are sexist. It's just what. It's just know, yeah. It's you're. <laughs> Damn. It's uh yeah. It's it's sad. It is sad. <laughs> oh yes, exactly. <laughs> hey Jonathan, do you want my raisin cookies? My last two in this pack. Cause I'm about to finish one. I love that we're talking about insanely gay shit while you have like roommates and like listening. <laughs> <laughs> my roommates are very well my roommate i think is very cool with me being extremely gay that's I cool well now that there's girls here we can talk about even gayer shit now that we oh, know no. now that we know that there are girls listening <laughs> i'm not eating your food bro bailey <laughs> bailey's eating the food actually shit i have a um i have a thing of grapes in here that i saved from earlier God, I love this. I'm gonna eat this the, uh, the, uh, we're getting field recordings of Bailey's room right now. <laughs> These are gonna be used in a in a murder case. Oh location. yeah, this is like this is going on the new Tim Hecker, you know. <laughs> oh hey, did you ever watch um, you know that guy who did um, 
He was on like iCarly. Yeah. Uh, Wait, oh, Dan Schneider. No, no. I do. Oh, I actually do have a story about Dan Schneider. Oh, tell us. You got groomed oh. by him. No. <laughs> uh, oh. So I um when all that Dan Schneider stuff was coming out, um I my mom knows the um like the head of the New York division of Nickelodeon. What? Oh. And yeah. So I went there on a tour. Yep. Um, and we were sat down. And I asked him about Dan Schneider. <laughs> Yo, yeah. did he fuck kids? What's the deal with that? <laughs> <laughs> no, I asked him because I was like, I like he brought up iCarly, and I was like, yeah, the producer of that did he get fired? And he was like, yeah, um, uh, some not so tasteful things. Oh my god! So you guys got hot scoop right here. Yo, executive at at the New York branch of um of Nickelodeon admits that. He Probably diddling kids, maybe. He probably did. Yeah. The head of Dan Snyder's a gross person. You, you, heard, Snyder, you heard it here. The K-Zone, K-Zone breaking news. Yes, this is this could be on CNN. It could be. Uh, <laughs> they just, like, have a picture of you on the side in, like, the maid outfit. <laughs> you, are he- <laughs> you are hearing the voice of this person. <laughs> That's... They don't even play just a clip. They play the whole stream on Bailey. Television. Bailey, like, don't get hit by a car or something, because that'll be like the picture that they use. <laughs> oh, like... no. God, that's the, like I'm worried about like dying in like a mass shooting or something, and those are like the only pictures they have of me. Oh my god! I hope um, I haven't. You know, I had a nightmare. Yeah. When I was out at a party. Yeah. That I was gonna die. And then my parents were gonna search my room and find, like, skirts and shit. You could always be like, yeah, no, I like to dress girls up. Technically, I would be dead in this scenario. I oh, could. you could, yeah. Well, oh, yeah, yeah. You'd be, you'd be, you'd leave behind like audio recordings and shit. You're like, hello, yeah, yeah. hello, father. If you're listening to this, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> I have, I have been killed. I need to clarify. This isn't gay oh. stuff. <laughs> this is not gay. Lots of boys are into this. I swear, this is, uh, have you ever heard of, I, okay, I legit had to explain to my mom what a femboy was. Wait, your mom? Mm, oh my god. I had to explain to my mom what a femboy was. Oh my god, I was like reading about people coming out as femboys and just being baffled by it. What? Why would you come out as a femboy? I don't understand, yeah, I don't get it, it's like. It's like a friend, it's not an identity. Exa- exactly, it's like. Maybe, maybe your parents don't need to know that you wear girls' clothes. Maybe you can tell them when you're, when you're like, 50. Bye. <laughs> yeah, maybe you can tell them when you're, like, when they're almost dying and you don't care. Yeah, exactly. Like, let that be their last memory of the world before the DMT hits. <laughs> I love my sexy son. <laughs> I love my sexy son. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I always wondered why you had... Son, I always wondered, when we shook hands before you left, why you had women's skin. <laughs> I was always curious. You have because I'm back and I'm like, why you look younger? Like, oh, what the <laughs> fuck you? Why do you look like a fourteen-year-old? <laughs> Son, it's so weird to me. Like, I already look young. Yeah. The idea of me looking younger is so fucking confusing. You look, yeah. That's fucking funny. Yeah. I have people ask me I'm 14. <laughs> How tall are you? I'm like six foot. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Yeah. I've been killed by a robot. I'm not short anymore. Um. In like ninth grade, uh, my parents got me on growth hormone. <laughs> I was like, I was like 5'1. Take your moans, son. Take your hormones, son, but not those. No, not that. No, oh, oh, God. <laughs> I basically had built-in hormone blockers. Right. And they took them away from me. Yep. You were growing too much. They ruined me. Yep. Got that physique. I was really, you were, I was like, how, how did you get your body like that? And you were like, oh, yeah, I run six kilometers a day. I was like, oh, f- <laughs> fuck. <laughs> like, They're yeah. not that bad, I promise. He was like, yeah, I go for walks sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you can you can do it. I believe in you. Oh, I could look good if I tried. Quarantine got me kind of fat in the gut. Um, bro, 
The good thing about running is you can do it without a gym, bro. Yeah. You just got to go out and start. Mm-hmm. I mean, you can run around your fucking apartment. Yeah. I could just annoy the shit out of my neighbors. Be like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Not gonna, or not around your apartment as in in your apartment. Like, you know, around the block. Yeah. I thought you meant like in my house. <laughs> just like doing max no max pain dives around the like a house. <laughs> oh, man. Making the face and you everything. Probably wait set, bro. I probably should. Yeah, I, I, fucking, I don't know uh, if. Yeah, I, I do. Yeah. My workout routine is basically six miles. And then three sets of 10 pull-ups. Nice, man. I don't know if I want to go, like, lean or muscular. See, here's the thing. I got... What do you think? Hmm. You've seen, I mean, what, you've seen what I look like. Yeah. Oh. I don't know. It's weird. You know? You do have the Duma look going. You could honestly go either way. Yeah, I don't, I'm thinking lean might work. Because I, I do have genetic bags under my eyes that I can't get rid of. Mm-hmm. It's that fucking just it's the Slavic phenotype, but I I've got those weird sunken eyes. I can't help you looking like that, you know. Oh, Bailey, did we lose you? Oh, Bailey might have died. Everyone. Yeah, there we go. Okay, I'm back. Oh, you're back. I'm back. Okay. Yeah, my connection shit itself. Uh, th these things just happen. We assume like your roommates like disconnected you no my um my dorm uh has shitty wi-fi oh it'll just like drop out at random points yeah you're back now and that's all that matters yeah did I you did back. you hear me talking about my uh genetic thing where i have like bags under my eyes that i can't get fucking yeah. rid of yeah i did hear about that that oh i think you can i i, I genuinely think you could either way mm. I like the eye bags, though. That's the thing. They make me look like I'm thinking. A girl told me once that they made me look like I was thinking about deep shit. <laughs> and it's like, no, I'm, I'm just rotating like a cube in my mind. <laughs> you've got a... You, you've got fucking... Uh, what's it called? The, that video of the cockroach spinning around? <laughs> I've got that going. Yeah, no, that's going on in my brain all the time. Based. Hell yes. Um... Fucking, uh, I think, um, the best, my best advice would just be don't, like, starve yourself. Yeah, because bad things happen oh, when you do that. Of course, dude. Fuck off, Discord. Yeah, just don't skip meals and shit. Um. <clears throat> Sorry. Oh, God. Bailey. Bailey! He's dead, everyone. I'm sorry. Oh. Everybody post R.I.P. for Bailey. It's just you and me now, gamers. Legs. Oh. <laughs> okay, no problem. A Discord crashed. He's going to hop back in when he's ready. Yeah, we got to tell his parents where his uh, girl's clothes are. How are you guys liking the stream so far? Bailey's pretty chill, right? Okay. This and that is how crap. we will kill Bailey. Oh, well, sorry. Hey, Bailey, how are you? What's happening? Oh, uh, no, nothing. We were nothing. We were just, yeah. Don't worry. I already have a plan to kill you. <laughs> oh, no. You're going to have to fucking travel across the country to get me, or across the fucking ocean to I get will. me. I will. Probably, yeah, bro, when quarantine lifts. You could air me, you could airmail me fucking asbestos, I guess. That <laughs> kill me in like a couple years. Just send you like a really, send you plastic. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you touched the receipt. Dip shit. It's like oh, my roommate, uh, my roommate started not touching receipts now because they have soy in them. Oh, God. It's like, fuck, you've played Metal Gear Solid 5, right? Uh, I played, I haven't beaten it, but oh, I have. Oh, it's like, it's like how Skullface makes uh, Major Zero retarded because he gives him, like, a knife that pricks him, but it's me sending you, like, a receipt. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking face. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I get you. You send me. Oh God. The estrogen is already in your system, Major. No. No, I can feel my T levels dropping. No, my testosterone. I'm losing my gains. <laughs> Please. 
I'll tell you this much, it's way, way harder to fucking, like, uh, you know, I guess lift weights and shit now. Oh, because you're weak as a kitten? Yeah. Yeah. I'm not fucking weak. Shut up. I fucking, I'm Shut up. I, yeah, yeah, okay, this is the bullying Bailey section. Shut up. I've got more fucking muscle than you do. You I guarantee it. Shut up. I could, <laughs> I could throw you through a wall. <laughs> Uh, maybe, but I'm fucking. I'm certainly more fucking like. I'm yeah. certainly more built than you. Are you I've fucking? Got, are you fucking it. mogging me on my show? I am. I am muscle mogging you. Are guys. you fuck? Am I being mogged? Start doing fucking crunches, faggot. <laughs> I'm seeing your belly. Get, no. It's not. It's not shredded. Get ripped. Get a fucking pull up bar. Oh, I tell this to everybody. Get a pull up bar. I'm being fucking mogged by the Twitter fan boy on my fucking show. He's just... <laughs> I'm going to fucking mog you. You were gonna get mogged, kid. Get yeah. mogged. Hey, fuck it. Hey, dude. Get fucking mogged, eh? Hey, Tone. Hey, this... buddy. Hey, Tone. This fucking femboy's mogging you. Hey, Tony. This, uh, this, this femboy over here, he's, uh, he's mogging you. Hey. <laughs> I don't take kindly. Sure. To, I don't take kindly to being disrespected by Twitter femboys. <laughs> hey, I don't take kindly that kind of talk. How am I gonna come Just back see. from this? I don't think I can. What? Being being mugged by me? <laughs> Bailey, just you, <laughs> you just throw your shirt off. I'm like, oh. <laughs> Somebody said money machine intro improv. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh fuck. I can't, okay, I, I, there was a moment when I was listening to, uh, I wasn't listening to Money Machine, but I was listening to Stupid Horse, because I was doing it as, like, a bit, and I was like, oh my god, I get it now. You feel I it? I understand the appeal. Oh. I get it. It still, it still sucks. I oh, it's, like it. it's like, mindless self-indulgence, but retarded. Howdy, Mark. Yes, but I got it. Oh, I, oh, fuck, dude, I, I, okay, I actually like Mindless self I love mindless self-indulgence, man. That's the good shit. Mindless self-indulgence is good ass shit. Shut me up is 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 good as hell. Mm. Good taste all around. So is um, what is uh, what? Okay, what's your what's your like top five uh, bands? My top uh, Skinny Puppy, Fetus, mm -hmm. Cam the M, uh, Black Moss Super Rainbow, mm -hmm. and. I like Sewer Slut right now. Damn, bro. You're listening to some fucking... Some underground shit that I've never heard of. Yeah, it's just, <laughs> yeah I'm, I'm now I'm taste-mogging you. <laughs> you get, actually are. Get dunked on. Fucking, my favorite shit right now is fucking Blue Oyster Cult. <laughs> uh, fucking Billy Joel. Uh, uh, fucking... What's it called? Uh, Death Grips. Um, and probably... Uh, Miracle Musical. Of course, you listen to. Fun. You look like a Death Grips kid. You're just like, yeah. Whoa. Listen, my my. Okay, my boyfriend is way more into it than I am. He's been. Oh, I I love Death Grips, man. That was that was good high school good. music for me. Fucking uh, uh, what's it called? Is it We Found we did Footage? It read or... it. Uh, I've seen footage. Uh, Bailey, you gotta say th you gotta say thank you to, for subscribing an essential voice because we just got a oh, subscriber. Uh, an essential voice. Yeah. Okay. Right. ASMR. All right. Um, uh, hey, thank you for subscribing. Is that good? That was great. Thanks. That'll be our new sound. Perfect. That'll be our new subscribe Don't... sound. Actually, that would be funny. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be okay with that. That's... <laughs> you gotta go back. Oh, uh, yeah, Bailey. I told. I, I told. I can do it again if you want. Uh, please, please do. Yeah. Make it like. You should have. We, we, this will be like our. Yeah. Well, I, I'm gonna be a guy who like asks you for like a reward, but it's you holding like a sign in the maid outfit saying "Subscribe to Komodo Friend Zone." <laughs> <laughs> That'd be fucking great. That'd be great. Oh, we could have it. People, oh. If somebody drops, um, how many subs can you drop at a time? Five, I think you can gift sub. Yeah, that'll be a reward. We'll get more Bailey. Yeah. What is the highest Bazinga. sub tier you can drop? Do it again. I don't know, but we need people do to it. subscribe. Somebody said do it again after they subbed. Yeah. Well, uh, he's got a... Okay. 
Do it again. Thanks for subscribing. Yeah, thank you. Thanks, guys. I won't You're fuck welcome. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> if if someone gives five subs, Bailey, will you Was put on the good. will you put on the maid outfit? <laughs> and, and say, Bro, this is shit. So people keep subbing. People keep subbing. All right, come on, keep subbing. Bailey's gonna wear the maid outfit. Thanks for subscribing. Oh, thanks. All right, thanks. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I've got to keep fucking doing this. It's you still, have to keep going. Train. It's a hype train. Oh shit! Did we get a hype train? If y'all gifting ten so Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> Bailey's got to do more. <laughs> Christ! What do I have to do? Do I? You, have to you gotta wear to wear the maid outfit and have a sign saying "Please subscribe to Komodo Friend Zone." You have to remind me to do that. Uh because i'm not gonna remember but i will do it i will oh my god <laughs> bailey oh my god it just keeps coming <laughs> yo thanks subscribing thanks everybody i can't tell if it's actually good or not it's, it's good Bazinga. okay as long as i don't sound like a fucking idiot people are pogging people are <laughs> pogging oh my if we, we need like a feet cam for you no! To... <laughs> yes, we do. <laughs> no, we don't. We are 100% getting a foot cam. <laughs> You're just like waving your feet. <laughs> Fuck. Wait, why are people Bazinga. saying yes? It was it for the foot cam? It was for the foot cam. No! People want... Be done for the feet cam. I don't even have a webcam. Oh, oh, fuck it. Let's buy Bailey a webcam so that he can, he can post feet. <laughs> we'll just have a picture of your feet in, like, in, like the corner. And, <laughs> like, really small. No! You know how, like, when Adult Swim, like, played the Aqua okay. Teen Hunger Force movie, but it was, like, really fucking tiny and in a corner? It'll be that. Bazinga. <laughs> have you never seen my feet, dude? I've, I've seen... I think I've seen everything. I think I've seen everything you have but your feet, actually. They're disgusting, bro. Oh god. They're no, they're not Bazinga. good. They're cuz running running damages your feet if you run a lot. Uh-huh. Like if you run long distance, your feet end up being fucked. Got them like for sure. Yeah, runner's feet are fucked. Oh, uh, oh. So you guys won't like runner's feet. You guys will not like uh like the feet cam. Oh my god. <laughs> you first person to get on the stream. I'll do, I'm just going to bump the stream on Twitter and be like, "Yo, Bailey's talking about his feet." Yo, Bailey's talking about his fucking toes. Yo, Bailey's talking about his feet. Bits. <laughs> I don't know how many that is. How many bits is a what lot? In the god. Uh, a lot. I don't know. A lot. So bits. random. Walk down raw street. I don't even know what bits are. Do they give you cash? The bits give. Yeah, bits give us cash. I, I think. Also, I, I'm just. Yeah. yeah whoa. That's if somebody true. gifts a hundred subs. Oh my god. Um. Uh, I will, uh... He will fly uh, out. We will fly him out. He will record... I will send a, I will send a picture. Bailey will uh, record a short audio you. recording of him blowing his nose. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> come on, baby. Uh, Just... Come on, baby. Come on, Bailey, baby. baby. Blow me! Blow my load! Come on, we gotta get the hype train going. Come on, Two Bailey, more. just post post one molar, please. <laughs> okay, okay. What uh in the chat? What would what would I have to do to get uh a hundred subs? Yeah. Right but now? What would you have? Someone's gonna donate a hundred dollars. They can I'm do not, that. Here's the things I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna post uh I'm not gonna post full on noobs. Post like, hole. One hundred percent. We'll never do that. Bailey's gonna post hole. <laughs> I will not post hole. I will post hole. <laughs> That's the one thing I will not do. Okay. <laughs> Let's negotiate but, uh, the terms, yeah. But May Big Money Eddie said made outfit. So is this Femboy Rocky has I am not a reply guy. guy. We're Femboy buddies. <laughs> I am not I have never reply guide in my life. Bailey will post a single testicle. I will post <laughs> Post one ball, but you're like standing across the room. <laughs> you're not sure what you're looking at. <laughs> It's like it's like a James Blake album cover. Oh uh, fuck! Hours of dirty talk audio. Fuck. You're already getting dirty talk audio. That's what this is. One thousand dot. One thousand subs for both testicles. <laughs> okay, I'll post. I will send you both testicles if you give a, a thousand subs right now. Bailey will post balls. <laughs> I'm using my balls, baby. Yeah, that's using Short your balls. Uh, I will- Oh god, whoa! I just got fucking- <laughs> Whoa! <laughs>
<laughs> I will get into my uncle's coke drawer and I will. <laughs> Bailey's gonna do some lines. <laughs> I'm gonna do lines for subs. Come on, Bailey. This is fuck. This fucking sucks. Come on, Bailey. I got rent to pay. <laughs> All right, 19 seconds. 18 seconds. Somebody sub. Somebody sub, please. Somebody sub. Come on. Oh, Daddy needs a new pair of shoes. Daddy needs new shoes. Or er, fucking. All right, well, there it goes. There it go. Oh God. I trained success. Hail to oh, the king, baby. We did it. Oh my God. Wait, what? Oh, we did. Yeah, we did it. Somebody subbed. Did someone? No, someone followed. I think. Oh no, somebody subbed. Really? Yeah. Bazinga. Somebody subbed. Oh, someone is subbing. I can hear it. Did they say something? I, I don't know. I don't think they said anything. No. We yeah, no, no uh, testicle pick guys. That was the rule. to the king, baby. No, Keep following though. So I, I love that this has turned into like a cam show but without a cam. Yeah, there's no cam. I'm just saying I'll do stuff. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> That's the extra sub. Yeah, no. I love how you engage oh our God. audience. <laughs> now this is engagement. I have simps, but not for me. I'm not making any money off this. That's, yeah, no, I'm, I'm making rent. Put the maid pick back up. Which oh, one? Oh, God. Isn't it back? Isn't it still up? It's up on fucking the... It's, the, it's, it's up. The Twitch header. It's the Twitch header. What what maid pick? I'm not a pimp. I am a pimp, but not in that sense. Rocky's a pimp. Excuse me. <laughs> if, I was, if I was a pimp, I'd be getting paid. Yep. No, I totally showed my balls. You just can't see it. <laughs> <laughs> Bailey actually has his balls out right now. I can just tell. Yeah, this, this is mutual aid simping. <laughs> this is government simping. I don't. I won't do a GoFundMe, but I will bring Bailey on when I need to pay rent. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> all right, Bailey, get the cam going and start waving your digits around. <laughs> <laughs> How many fucking subs do you usually get? Uh, quite a lot. Yeah, we're, we're doing pretty good. But this is. It's nice to bring guests on because you bring in new people. Yes, yes, I'm bringing new people. You're to, you're you know. widening the net. I feel like the Justin Wang stream must have fucking gotten me like. Oh, we did. I literally do not think I can ever go back in that room because there's grenades in there. Yeah, no, you're fucked. <laughs> go in there and immediately blow up. <sighs> Many such cases. Yep. Damn, you really fucked that up. Oh, bro, <laughs> bro. Is there a second entry? I don't think there, there is. is. I, I guess I could just never go in there again. Oh well. As long as it's not a quest, I guess. What, what quest are you on? Uh, I don't know. I'm just wandering around, really. It's a good oh, game. Okay. Yeah, we're just we're just going for a wander. Finding shit. Weren't the shoot. Felix streams? The oh yeah, we had Felix from Chapo on here a few times. <gasps> what? Yeah, dude. Oh fuck, that's awesome. Yeah, man. That's fucking. Fun. They're on. If you want to go watch them, I think we have the vods on YouTube. They're in a playlist. Cool. So tell cool. me when you tell me when you get Adam on, so I can just join the Discord at a random point and harass Adam. Yeah, just ju second. just jump in and be like. <sighs> Adam, I need you to. I need you to take me. Adam, Adam, breed me. <laughs> Adam, please. <laughs> I swear I'll laugh at your shitty jokes. <laughs> uh, Adam, please. I never. I tried listening to Chapo. I don't know. I. I, I think I might be too fucking stupid. You just to get yeah. Into fucking Chapo. Got that. Got that I'm bimbo. Not smart on politics. It's that bimbo brain acting up. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. I'm not a fucking bimbo. I'm not a I'm bimbo. Fucking smart. Not a bimbo. Okay. Oh, so I, well, <laughs> I'm fucking. I don't know. Whatever. I'm, I'm just uh, like. I'm, I'm just a, uh, with a rocket launcher. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck! I love that video. It's so good. Uh, I want Felix to crush me between his pec and bicep. Oh um, god! This is this is the horniest know? stream we've ever done. Is Felix the one with the black hair. Yeah. The glasses. Oh, Felix is cute. Yeah. Oh, cute. Okay. Uh, yeah. I was start. Hold on. Let me. Love the Which one was gun. the one that like got super drunk on stream? Just. Uh, that saying, was that like, was Kush bomb. Okay. Good old Kush bomb. Yeah. No. Felix. Uh. Felix from Chapo. Yeah. Felix is cute. Yeah. Um. Which Chapo would you fuck? I would fuck him, and I would fuck the one in the like glasses that with no facial hair. All right. Bailey. Yeah. Bailey will post elbows if you keep subbing. I will post elbows. He will. He will Can do that. He will. Break? He will do that weird thing where you make a pussy with the middle of your arm. Yeah, I'll do the pussy arm thing if you give us um. By fifteen subs. Fifteen subs. Yeah. Fifteen. Fifteen subs. 
<laughs> then I will do that. Yeah, no ba Bailey. Get the maid Bailey pick. will. What maid pick? We, you do owe the maid pick, by the way. Yes, that we established what? that. Okay. What maid pick is it? It's do it's I you dressed as a dress, a dressed in a ma dressed in the maid outfit, holding a sign saying "Subscribe to Kimono Friend Zone" and then a link to this Twitch. Oh, I can't do that right now. Not right, not right do now. Roommate. Well, do it with your roommate, and he'll yeah. understand. Just be like, "Yo, it's theater." He will not. He, he will, will not. He will not understand. He no, will no, no, one hundred percent be cool. He knows I have that shit, but also I don't want to do that. I don't want to. Do oh, that. you don't have to do it right now. But like your roommate can just sit there knowing that you're gonna do it at one point, and he can just go about his DM day. Me, DM me tomorrow, and I will do it. All right, thanks, man. Thanks, it. brother. See, this yeah. is this is what this is what friends are for, making your homies do gay shit for you. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. That's just that's what having homies is like. That's what that, that's what the ICP song "Homies" is about. <laughs> <laughs> this is Simp Theater. What? DM me to remind me to DM the Femboy. Yeah. yeah. Yes. His name is Bailey, thank you. <laughs> uh, excuse me? <laughs> excuse me. Don't don't come in here disrespecting my fly girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck. Looks like norm Rocky normalized sex work for the homies. I'm not doing any sex work. All right. I'm. I'm. It's I'm not. not I'm work. not normalizing sex work with. But I am normalizing sex with the homies. Yes. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes you just want to kiss your homies goodnight. Sex with the homies and kissing the homies is cool. That's the good shit. There ain't nothing wrong with kissing the homies. Ain't nothing Don't wrong. Make Don't make it weird. Yeah. Exactly. It's like sometimes you just gotta kiss your homies goodnight. Maybe, you know, maybe suck their dick a little bit. Like, it's only gay if you make it gay. Hey, maybe slide the tip of that penis into your mouth. Maybe give a little, give him a little head. Hey, who knows, you know? He, he was, you know, it's like we're buddies. You know, we blow each other sometimes, but it's not a big deal. Somebody said, call me by your internet name. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? I, I'm not fucking being, I am kind of being pimped out. You're not being pimped You You are... Bailey's gonna have to, yeah, holding up a sign saying I'm here of my own free will. I need, um, I need at least five dollars in payment. Ma'am, Bailey, if you are being <laughs> held hostage, wiggle your feet twice. Uh, I'm gonna need to, uh, you know, maybe I'll need to get a little bit of payment. Maybe you'll have to send me, uh, you know. Maybe give me Discord Nitro for a month. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe buy me Discord Nitro so I can use funny emotes. Maybe, yeah, we get all the funny emotes. Get all that good shit. If you're, if you're being held hostage, post a picture of your feet. If you're being, ma'am, if you are being hostage, get one of your balls out. If you're not, get two. <laughs> <Just like. laughs> oh, fuck. Rocky's going to start using the Femboys in the Discord server if he falls on hard times. So I, listen, not. I, 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 I am not. Her. I have never used... I would never do that. You are my flock. I was... they, look, I've got a lot of young, vulnerable white gamers in the in my Discord, and it is important that I keep them safe. Yes. Please. A lot of very vulnerable white Hail gamer king, boys baby. that we need to... Did somebody just sub? Uh, no, they followed. Okay, I was like, did somebody just sub? I heard the fucking Duke Nukem voice. I was like, what does that mean? It means it, it, All right. the Bazinga one means someone subbed, which someone should sub. Uh, so Bailey, Sony Soprano voice. Now this. AJ's a fucking femboy. <laughs> <laughs> AJ's, AJ's, AJ's a fucking femboy AJ's now. AJ's a fucking femboy. Jesus, eh? what, do you, what, what do you got all these pictures of your asshole for? Yeah, these pictures of your asshole building up on your TV, uh... You tell me you do this on the internet? You, you telling me people will, pay, is... people will pay for pictures of your asshole? Text and OnlyFans. AJ, what the fuck are you talking about? AJ. AJ. AJ, I need you to stop printing off furry, furry pornography. AJ, for... you spent your That's entire my... fucking month's pay commissioning your fursona? <laughs> <laughs> I don't see the problem, Dad. I don't see the problem. He's just expressing himself. Hey, I have a good father figure, all right? He's a great man. He just... Yeah, he just... He just... Baby. He accidentally dropped Bailey on, like, he threw him too high and he hit the ceiling. I did, in fact, get dropped on my head. Oh, God. It's just like, people used to become serial killers because of that. Now they just become like this. I, I would... I wouldn't hurt... Well, I would hurt a fly. Fuck flies. But fuck I would... I, I would never kill a man. 
Oh, I could just yep. fuck a man. <laughs> oh, I could just fuck a man. <laughs> I'm going to. I'm going to be. Um, the. Yeah, if I get added to the percentage of this, like the suicide, like percentages, um, I need that. I need you to. I don't know. I don't know. I can I. Can they put a picture of me? They a, a picture of you on the news will just be you wearing the, the either the gay AF hat or like you dressed as the maid. Either one. Bailey, would... I skirt at too young of an age. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck yeah! Yes, oh. that's true. Ma'am, I'm afraid your son has the worst case of bimbo brain we've ever seen. <laughs> I'm afraid your son. Uh, you know we we don't see this often, but. He's got the uh, bimbo brain. You don't see this too often, but your son, you know, he, he's just, he just taps you on the head like, oh, this soft spot's not going to close. This is not, uh, yeah, this is not normal. Did you happen to drop him and mayhaps, uh, at, right after dropping him, uh, like, maybe he touched, like, a shoe or, like, <laughs> like a dress or something? It's, I don't know what, um... You know, ah, you see, you you uh, we, you weaned him on the plastic bottle. Yes, <laughs> this is uh, this is a very common develop. I would like to see a modern day psychologist handle the 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 concept of femboys. I, like, I think that'd be very interesting. Oh man, it's like, why? Well, yeah, I would like to see it. I would like to understand why it's why it became a thing with normies. <laughs> Wish Jordan Peterson didn't fucking. <laughs> he hasn't like become this fucking depressed like oh my IOD god and his fucking daughter's like cucking him and shit I w we how need can to... your daughter cuck you bro that's just so funny god we need to tell Z <laughs> we need to tell like Zizek about like femboys oh my god genius now Peterson, I am sexualized <laughs> because I associate womanhood with sex now I am sexualized <laughs> Now I can become the sex object. Oh God, I hate it! I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> now I. <laughs> now I am the sex object. <laughs> now I am the object of desire, just as I viewed the woman, <laughs> because I associate womanhood with sex. I too wish to become the sex object. <laughs> <laughs> I, as they say on the internet, I will become the girlfriend. I actually think I actually think that is that is a part of it. Yeah, think, no. I think, uh, Spencer, my friend Spencer did. had like a joke where he said like men take one L and then they medically transition to female. <laughs> it's, I didn't take any L. No, I. I oh my god! It's, oh, I gotta tell you that story about prom. Fuck, that was a major W. Yeah. Um. Well, here, you 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 say what you had to say. I, I was just I I. I had we had a friend who transitioned after they had a breakup and I've seen that happen a few times where they just they just like ah oh, fuck it I'll just be the girlfriend now and wow. you know and good for whatever good for them I guess I mean yeah if that if that works they good look for them they look decent yeah um well, what were you gonna I, say uh, so in in I think 11th grade mm -hmm. um this girl that I did I already say this? Did I already tell the story about about, this, about... Uh, this this girl that I thought I was friends with invited me to prom? No, go ahead. And and uh, we went and it was fine. And um and I brought her to her doorstep. Mm. Uh, afterwards, and I was like, hey, you know, good night, uh, or whatever. And I was like, I had a good night, and she was like, I had a good night too. Uh, and I opened the door, and and then she she poked her her lips <laughs> out to kiss me. Oh. And I kissed her on the cheek. <laughs> oh man, that's you got the ball in your court when that happens. I, you know, I. Uh, you walk. I did you? The bag did you walk away that, feeling I good? I honestly, I dodged a bullet. Yeah. <laughs> I, I dodged a horrible bullet. Oh she man. Horrible bitch. God, let. She was a horrible bitch. Being chased by girls and letting them know you're like not interested is, it's a big dick thing. I I have. I have literally only ever rejected women. Mm. <laughs> I have, I have never, ever asked a girl to go out with me. <laughs> oh, man. were you? Did you know you were like gay always? Is that how it worked with you? No, bro. No, I mean I'm not gay. I'm bisexual. But oh, me, yeah, me too, brother. But 
Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. I mean, in that no, sense, I did not know I was into guys. I did not know I was into guys for a while. Um, but uh, if a, I don't know, if one of my friends who I, if one of my like straight friends asked me to go out with them, yeah, why, were, like, why are these people not wearing clothes? <laughs> And the hats, and they're wearing funny hats. What is going on here? The funny hat man. Oh. Base sexual. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Ah, uh, fuck. Um, what the fuck was it? Uh, shit. Oh, have you fucking? Uh, did you watch the Come Town bit on uh Five Ish? I did. Yes. Dude, that shit's so funny. It rules, <laughs> man. I was fucking rules. That's the good Holy shit. Fuck. Oh, it's so funny. Oh. Like the fact that that exists is fucking hilarious. It has. They have I, to like understand how bad it looks. To like. I mean, yeah, they had like a bit where they're like, um, <laughs> yeah, of course I wasn't in a tower. <laughs> <laughs> they have a bit where the the fucking dollar oh, bills the... calling somebody and they're like, no, pull out. Uh, it's stocks. Uh, they're talking about like stocks and shit. Yo, it's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> it's a five dollar bill oh, it's a five dollar bill it's <laughs> oh, tom's voice at that Jesus. oh fuck adam just being like i don't i don't think people outside the community should see this you know i uh <laughs> i don't know i uh i i really fuck I, adam does seem like a cool guy he's Adam's cool like we met yeah we met him he was fucking cool I but, think I think they have a set dynamic for their bit that works, and I don't think he's. I hope to God he's not treated like that. No, no, well. that was that was a question that I actually asked, and he's like, no, no, we're friends. It's a bit. Yeah, yeah, no, it seems it seems pretty clearly like a bit, but I was yeah. like, uh, you know, after fucking the funhouse shit, where one of them like beat off at fucking work and shit, and everybody hated him. Oh. Yeah, Adam is irreplaceable shit. Yeah, dude, that shit fucking sucks. The ones where it's just like him, uh, Nick, and Stav, or where they're just riffing nonstop are really good, though. Nick and Stav is so... Because they don't have anybody to, like, anybody to tell to shut up. They just, yeah. Like, that was where, um, that was where Come, Come Eats in our Gordon. That, oh, God. I was, <laughs> I was driving home from a party and listening to that, and I actually had to pull over and, like, so that I would just, like, not cry laughing at the traffic lights. I... It was so funny. One of the things. I, I, oh, go ahead. Yeah. Out laughing. One of the things I used to do when I work, I used I used to work with deaf people, so I would just li I would take them like one of my my job was that I would just like drive them around and stuff, take them shopping, and I would listen to like Come Town in the car, That's because obviously they obviously they couldn't hear it, and I'd just be like trying not to laugh really hard like an idiot, because it would like alarm them, <laughs> like what the fuck are you laughing so hard about? <laughs> oh fuck. Oh, uh, the only emaciated gamer asked, uh, were any of you guys into Sleepy Cabin when that was new? Yes, I was so into Sleepy Cabin. Man. I was fucking huge into that shit. I, w I mean, I watched all those guys' shit from before Sleepy Cabin. But mm. Yes, I was heavily... That, um, four, uh, Spaz Kid and Sleepy Cabin oh. and, like, got me into, uh, were probably the reason why I ended up, uh, as, like, like this. Um, <laughs> That kid is like a very large, uh, had a very large impact. Uh, oh God! You like Western? I, I see. I'm too much of a fucking snob. I don't enjoy Western art. No, dude, I can get into it. Do you not like Spaz Kid? Not. I don't like. He's nice as a person, but I don't think I like his art. That's fair. No, I love. Uh, I like. I like Western art. I mean, I, I, I am a fucking Western artist. So of course. I, like I mean, in the, I mean, like pornography. I just don't enjoy that. Oh, oh, no. I, I, uh, like in. I don't beat off to it or anything, but, um, I yeah, did yeah. see Spaz Kid like a fucking. I I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have. Uh, yes, I I do have a boyfriend waiting. I'm about to get off. All right. Uh, but you brought up Sleepy Cabin, so yes. Uh, I was bringing that up, and yes, he did do the Sonic Two animated series. You should all go listen to uh, uh, fucking Sleepy Cabin. Uh, it's very good. Uh, thank you for having me on. Nope. Very, are uh, you are you gonna? Can you do one more subscription drive now, or do you have to go? Oh yes. Come okay. on. Uh, Central voice. Subscribe. Please. Hey. Please subscribe. Please subscribe. Please. Please. Please subscribe. Oh, oh god, I just got blown up. Please. Subscribe. <laughs> uh, do you have any like shit that you want to plug or anything? Uh, fucking. Let's see. No. 
<laughs> you no. <laughs> Just follow my Twitter. Just okay, where Twitter. where can we find you, Bailey? If we don't know, uh, Postlytical Blit Two. How do you spell no, that? Bazinga! Oh, thank uh, you. Here come the subs. P O S T. Oh fuck! Did we just get subs? We are getting we are getting subs. So please nice. keep them coming. Uh, yes, we're nearly at, we're nearly at three hours. Sub. Oh, thank you for uh, subbing. Yeah, P O S T L I T I C A L B L I two. Well, Bailey, thank you so much for coming on the show. This was a really amazing stream. Um, you, we got to we got to get you back on here. You're a really good fit. Yeah, if you if literally anytime, dude. Oh, anytime. fucking I'd love man. to. You're so, yeah, no, you're cool, man. We'll have you on again. Right, uh, see you later, brother. I right, see you, bro. Bye. So everybody say goodbye to Bailey. Say bye, bye. to the say bye to the say bye to the people in the chat. Bye guys. Have fun. See you later, bro. Go have sex. And now, uh, I think it's it's just me now. Well, what did you guys think of that? Did you like our guest? That was a that was a very fun little stream. Uh, thank you guys so much for coming. Uh, if you're brand new here, please hit the follow button. Please subscribe because we do have we have fun guests on here sometimes, and uh, I apologize for how extremely gay that stream Hail was. To the king, baby. <laughs> I apologize for how gay it was. Uh, if you'd like to see our past streams with like Felix and stuff, you can go onto uh, YouTube.com/slash Kimono Friendzone. Subscribe to that. We have all the all the good shit that you uh, that you love. But uh, yeah, no. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm going to I'm going to sign off now, but Yeah, doctor, turn off my gay inhibitors. Uh All right. See you guys later. Thanks so much for coming. Got 104 people. This was a really really good time. Good night everybody. Good good evening, good afternoon, good night.